Shoops and the whoops. Hey, oh god, look. not the shoops. No, not we the have been whoops. Oh. You must all oh. die now. Fuck, I'm already dead. Mm. Yep. Okay. All right, anyways. Who would like to give the <laughs> recap? I don't want to. It's helpful. That's very helpful. There's inspiration on the line. I can claim it for myself. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Fucking, if no one else is going to. When we last left our not-so-intrepid heroes. Yeah, that's right. Get dissed, losers. <laughs> We had been just about to begin searching these mysterious caverns in this quarry here. Uh, rather thankfully, it was pretty uneventful, uh, other than potentially releasing a massively dangerous spirit of some kind uh, onto the world, which we may or may not have to deal with. And I'm going to lead towards not, because fuck that. Um, we had... Uh, basically uh, perused and and searched this place for various resources including several uh ores uh mostly uh the emotion soapstones i believe that was a pretty yeah. major thing for this for this quarry surprisingly uh that we didn't take it for granted a dumb tish. thank you all right we did find a secret well it's not really a path more so a a carved uh a passageway through a river uh, that was waterfalling into a main main chamber, uh, where we discovered a large underground lake uh, with several passages leading off of it. But more importantly, several camouflaged chokers ready to choke us. So we decided not to get choked. So we didn't choke in that decision, and we departed that it's, area. I decided to nickname those things "nope chokers." Nope. Just call them nope ropes. Anyways, uh. <laughs> So instead, we ventured back down here and further explored and prepared ourselves mentally, physically, spiritually, magically, whatever Lee you want to apply, to enter this room with this ominous goblinoid statue? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, see, I pay attention. And now we're being ambushed by Grix. It's true. Give me my inspiration. You've earned your inspiration. Damn straight, I And am. I need you guys to roll me initiative. No. <laughs> Alright. I hope that was entertaining. Yeah. Was. Hey. Holy fuck. Calm, calm down. <laughs> I am ready. Okay, don't calm down that much. Alright. <laughs> okay. Rolls in that one. Alright. Well, hey. Lapis, it's your turn. Let me keep an eye on your passives because those are important. Also, let me turn on the combat music. There we go. All right. Well, as hey, remember, I remember, you have the flaming bow. You, you have, have the flaming bow. Yeah. However, I am going to hold my action until one of them is within thirty feet of me because, at the current moment, I can't see any of them. All right. A Grick has gained initiative. His name is Sir Squiggleton the Third. Hmm. He triggers your shoops and your whoops, I believe. Nope, five more uh, feet. One more. Yeah. There we go. There we go. And I shall shoot him with the starlight bow. Yes. The plow. That will fly through the air, crashing towards him. However, his thick rubbery hide deflects the arrow, causing it to just barely miss. Darn. Yeah, his thick hide. Are you serving doing a nuisance touch? That's, that's a touch attack? Yes. Is it? What? This conjured weapon is made under pure energy. As per the conjured weapon rules, pure energy weapons go against touch. Does it's this like still your... use, like, my normal stats for the attack roll? Yeah, you just all your normal stuff. Oh. Don't mind me. I mean, I believe you. I'm just like, fucking, what the fuck is this shit? <laughs> that seems... While, while you're good. looking for it, I feel like these huh? things sound like... <laughs> what do you guys think? It is one of the sleeper combos that very few people have noticed, and it's quite tiny. And it might get changed on your... If combined with a damage keyword, hot damn. Yeah. Ah, oh, damn. 
Well, some of my pre-made spells may be updated then. Hot damn. <laughs> I made a lot of conjure weapons, and I did not notice that wording. Yeah, this oh, is, no. uh, that was added to be based off, like, the flaming scimitar style from yeah. the and shit. Brutal. Well, that I will certainly hit it. then, as it just says, oh, yeah. I, just need, I just need a touch. All right. 25 it fire. Burns. It burns the thick rubbery hide instead. Yep. Yep. 25 fire. As the creature is heavily singed by the blow, wounded in fact, but is still alive. <gasps> All right, I am injured. I am sad. I am the most angry now. Felt like you've you've ever seen the anger. As the creature will snap its beak, little tentacles twitching a little bit in annoyance. And how far did I move? Twenty-five feet. Thirty feet. I still have ten feet movement left. Which means who am I charging? Is it you or you? Or I could just do a normal move and then just do a... It'd be funny if it rages as a free action, just how angry it was. I know, right? I'm gonna rage as a free action. Hell yeah. Uh, we are going to move forward to here, and we're gonna roll a d2 to see why I attack. Top down. Go attack! You're the chosen one. Rip. Oh. Nice down you, bud. Tentacle! I mean tentacle, I mean bite! <laughs> Technical bite. Technical bite. Yeah. 27 to slap for 20 piercing, or 20 physical, and 6 acid. Jesus. As Ooh. a green ichor begins to pour from pour from the beak as it bites into your flesh. Yeah. Uh, can't fire you some flat-footed, or...? Yeah, first round, you, until you act, you're flat-footed. Unless you have yeah. a feet for oh. that. No, I don't. I take damage. Mm-hmm. All right, uh, with my secondary attack per my secondary natural weapon, I will use a tentacle upon you. Wibbly wobble, tentacle tentacle. Fucking great. Uh, it'll hit really uh, high on no. my dice, by the way. I have a question. Yeah. Well, I'm fast footed. Uh, plus two AC, one two shit. Never mind. It's all right. Eight, uh, Nineteen more bludgeoning. And since I hit you. With a tentacle, I'm going to use my bonus action to rend. Bonus action, I mean quick action. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Alright. And one more hit for 16. Yeah, we'll hit. Alright. Uh, do they have any or the uh, bypass? Nah, just, just straight. Just straight okay. attacks. I almost gave them DR bypass because they have a very thick beak, but I said nah. They too, they're already good enough as is. All right, as that one's turned, we go to another Grick. This one up here will curl out from the eye, uh, crawling out. What's your movement speed, my friend? That is what it is. Okay. And we'll spend some stamina to move. See here, it'd be okay. I'd be able to get to about here with my double move, and then I can use one action to move again. I just want to say three Gricks was already too many. Three, you said. Three was too many. Yes. Hmm. But, but Elfrey, the meal tonight is going to be amazing. All right, and I'll use another action to move to here. Mob stamina. Oop. Rick number three is going to crawl out from the mouth and just kind of slurp along the stone face, down the chin, down the body, to the ground, which will get me down to here at base elevation. And then from there, I will use quick action to move forward. 30 feet to here because that's difficult terrain. Oh no. And I oh. don't have enough movement to charge, unfortunately, because I won't be able to charge there, so nice. I'll just use another action to move to here. Alright. A hidden creature has gained initiative. <laughs> no shit. Man, I wish Kodak knew Burning Hands right now. 
20 plus Even if I knew it, it would take 10 minutes. No, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Such a big roll. All right. Um, from the ceiling above, a Grick will land right here. Oh, God. <laughs> and it will roll a d3 to see who he attacks. Pop down left, right. All right, Jack, you're the chosen one. What the fuck? Oh dear. This is against your flat-footed. <laughs> All right. Oh, well, I don't confirm my fumble. Oh, I also need to. I need to do one thing because he did hot drop from a pretty high height. So. Fuck. Barely, okay. You'd only suffer four points of non lethal. Okay. Um, movement, action. I do have my tentacle attack as well. Okay. And that's also a miss. Okay, carrying on. Ilfrin. Uh, real quick, does that. Oh, that's a tentacle. The bite has the acid. Okay, never mind. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Uh, well, the birds are not happy, um, mm. <laughs> as you might be able to imagine. Yeah. Uh, they're going to go ahead and start their, their bardic here. Uh, so let me see. So let me get the moats up here. So moats. I actually forget. Is it three or is it four right now? Fuck. It's been so long. It feels like it's been so long. Maybe. I don't mm. know. I've seen three before. Three. It's three. It's three. Yeah. I just real quick double check and I'm mm -hmm. like, I'm not that stupid. Okay. Uh, decisions. Decisions. You know, I kind of want to defend. Well, what do the birds want to do? They're just, they're just gonna. Hmm. Yeah, you know what, screw it. Alright, they're gonna move here. Uh, so, obviously they'll provoke. Yeah. Actually, no. They're just gonna... They're just gonna five foot flap here. Alright. Okay. Alright, uh, here's the, uh... Damage. One second. Probably not gonna matter. The attack roll doesn't matter. Ignore that. So, uh, that's gonna be... How much non-lethal? If they have DR for a specific type of damage, so, like, magic damage can bypass it. That does not mean the damage is completely negated or I still only suffer non-lethal. You still suffer non-lethal. Okay, because I know if they, I have, like, fire resistance, that can just negate the damage entirely, but I don't know. Yeah, if... resistance negates entirely. DR, you still... It's just because I have mate, normal DR and then I have DR magic added on top of that, which is why I was yeah. unsure. No, you're just all DR. Okay. Okay. So that's, so that's... That's three, uh, that's three. Three is your minimum? Yeah. Oh, indeed. One more. Um, and also, uh, enemies attacking that creature will have flanking. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Ilfrin, meanwhile, uh, will go ahead and step on up and slap some bitches down here. Yeah. Right, there we go. Okay, uh, so I'm just gonna go on ahead and attack this creature beneath me. I'm really tempted to do a spell, but... Yeah, there's a lot of them. I should probably do a spell. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and cast defensively here. I'm casting a first level spell, a DC. I'm going to extend a cast, so the DC is going to be 10. So let's get that out of the way. Awesome. Nice. Great. And then I'm just, once again, just going to do my good old, uh, I think it's just Seed Burst. Let me double check my spells, make sure I'm not misspeaking. Yes, yeah, Seed Burst. Cool. Uh, so let me get that rolled. And bam. Succeed spell. That yeah. is a touch attack. Uh, that's touch the first on one. number four. Uh, on number four, yes. That and I have flanking. Let's see. And also, it's duplicated. So here's the second damage. Holy so it's shit. seventeen piercing on the first one. Yeah, seventeen piercing. Uh, and then that'd be with flanking. It'd be an eleven. Actually, the bonus uh, to hit is not applying correctly. I believe. 
if I recall correctly. Let me double check my stuff. Should be, since it's a melee touch, it'd be strength mod plus your uh, rank bonus in the casting skill. Yeah, so my strength is two bonus in my. Yeah. And then you would have plus two for your uh, steady. No, oh, okay. That seems accurate. So four, um, five, six is what I'm looking at, probably. Which yeah, is what it's showing that, right that, now. That seems that's not including flanking, but yeah. Um, flanking would bring that to eleven, which would put me at a anything to your roll. I'm thinking about it. Like I know it's pretty close. I know it's, it's also close. wounded. It is wounded. By one point. You know what? I'll let it ride. Alright. Just barely dodged out of the way. Okay. Yeah. I had a feeling it would be that close, but I want to save my luck in case something more important happens. Yeah. But that's fine. Uh that is my turn. Alright, very good, very good. And just to be clear, um, you don't have any DR bypass on this? Uh, correct. Okay, so yeah. It, it does ignore the magic DR, but it doesn't ignore the other DR. I mean, well, I mean, technically it is a magical source of damage, but I'm not sure how that works. Yeah, either. so I ignored the magic DR. If I didn't, I would have negated in damage oh. entirely. So that's cool. All right, cool. But, uh, yeah. I did have my other DR apply. Okay, cool. All right, Jack, Understood. it's your turn. Are you muted? Damn, yes. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm going to a uh, 10 foot stutter step. And uh, Noct is going to step up and uh, attack instead. Although, technically, Jack would toss a bomb too, or a uh, uh, fire popper on a uh, Grick 5. You have flanking against it, although it doesn't really matter for range, I don't think, actually. No. I mean, <laughs> it might. It, does it apply my sneak attack? <laughs> no. Lucy, Damn it. don't have flanking. Lucy, you're not threatening with a fire popper. Mm. There's tannins later. Oh, oh hold on, though. No, hold on. It, this is... Okay, so... <laughs> provides flanking to friendly creatures against creatures they share space with. So that's the overwhelming horde ability. I I, I don't know. Like it, it oh. makes sense for me to not. Yeah, with your overwhelming right. horde, then yeah, it's flanking, which means you would yeah. have sneak attack. Yeah, Fuck yeah! Yeah, that ability's pretty broken. Okay, I like Fuck it. Fuck yeah, I, dude! I, I don't know. When I wrote that ability, I never even considered that interaction. But I'm fine with that interaction. That's great. That's, uh, <laughs> I need to roll as Jack. That's that's a crazy interaction. Oh, Back. In. Welcome back. Like, it hasn't been your turn yet. I don't like this. <laughs> it's okay. He's flanked. And he's getting snuck attacked with poppers. So, uh, seven fire, yeah. four sneak attack. Oh, um, wouldn't that be hit. eleven? Wouldn't that be eleven fire damage? Mm-hmm. Pretty, pretty technically, yeah. Yeah. All right. Fuck yeah. Yeah, there's a blade. If they have any fire waves, the sneak attack bypass. They them. don't. Well, I'm just saying, if you didn't know that was a wall save, I did. If you have sneak attack on an elemental attack, it will, the precision damage, well, not sneak attack, but precision damage in general, it That's will bypass. Unfortunate. Resistance. Please don't hit the birds. Yeah. And the second uh, fire popper just there. kind of fizzles out in your hand, unless that's a confirmed one. Let's find out. It's not. Okay. Not a just just <laughs> a little fizzle. I like how you rolled it manually, just in case. I don't know. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm used to doing the manual one. You're, you're fine. I'm oh, just going to find it amusing. And, uh, Nocto will, uh... Critical confirm! <laughs> Number five? Hell yeah. Eight. Yeah, same one. Alright, 24 damage. Is there a claw considered magical? Um, no. Alright. Unfortunately not. Damage applied. That one will slap, and we'll do minimum damage, because my magical DR. Jesus Christ. Well, I'm sad about that, but... What you mean? I have two more... Um... Uh, I believe it's, a uh, Two plus strength. Three. Alright. Damn applied. Yeah. yeah. I, I see you have a plus three above what you rolled, so I, I just need to know what the dice is. Alright. Good stuff, good stuff. Anything else? Yeah, you can actually have uh, two more attacks. Aha! Uh -huh. 
Also, keep in mind the moats are up if people want to use them. It's true. Not sure if Noct would be the best person for it, but you know, I think you can do it for your poppers too, right? Non lethal applied. You're gonna you do it for the poppers? I mean, if you're making a little bit of attack, yeah. If you have fast bombs. That one will miss. I don't, I don't have fast say... bombs, but you can do poppers without bombs, I thought. Or, without fast bombs. That was what I was told earlier, anyway. Uh, I don't I believe remember. that's the case. Let me go look. Because I bought fast bombs inside. Oh, you did? Okay, okay, that explains that. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, never mind. Okay, Sorry. because I don't have fast bombs yet. But I yeah. was told I could do iterative attacks with poppers, so... Oh! I mean, we can continue on way of looking up. Well... Yeah. It would matter, because I could use a moat to do fast poppers if I can... Or poppers if I can do it without fast bombs. Same action you used to throw a bomb. Poppers have range by 30 feet. These poppers deal to do, do. Yeah, same action you use as a bomb. You can't throw multiple bombs without fast bombs. Okay, so well, really I've been do doing that wrong this entire time. Rip. It's a rip indeed. Well, hey, it's, 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 it is what it is. Now we know. Mm -hmm. Indeed. Wait, how does Syra have fast bombs? She had magical talents? It's a German rank throne. Prerequisite. Oh, yeah. Are you sure? This, this is why I don't have it. <laughs> Let me go look. I'm pretty sure it's not. I'm reading it right now. It's right above Fire Popper. Regardless, last one's a miss. Anything else for your turn? Uh, no, that'll be it. All right. Mundane ultimate talents. On page 270. 276. That is German, yep. Well, uh, do I want to drop 30 feet or do I want to drop 20 feet? That's the real question. Well, apparently... 20 feet. Did that get changed? Let me go, I'm going to go look because that might have got changed. I forgot to remove it for Sarah. Um, I don't think it got changed because, or at least not since we started. It has stupid. not been in any of my updates. No, yeah. Just, I'm just stupid. No comment. I, <laughs> All right, six non-lethal as I drop prone right next to Nocta. Or not prone, I, I drop from the ceiling. I made my save, so it's only non-lethal damage. It's Hey, th that Grick does not provide flanking. That's... that's really sad. <laughs> <laughs> I moved here for flanking! Tactical fucking genius. Because yeah, these creatures specifically have pack tactics as their as a behavior talent or trait. I mean, I, it's in general. Yeah, I mean they're gonna do it anyways because they. Of they, course, they, yeah, don't they, they don't know. They don't know. They don't know. How yeah. could they know? <laughs> it's a fifteen to hit. <laughs> All right, and then I have my tentacle slap. Twenty six to hit for nineteen. That will hit. All right. And that's bludgeoning. Okay. Yeah. All right, and that is uh, rend as well because I hit with my tentacle. So another seventeen and nineteen to hit. Neither of those will hit. All right, good stuff. Oh, really great, uh, Devil. Do you yes. have underground chemist? I do. Okay, I'm just making sure. All right, it's uh, time for the murderer's turn. Let's go, Kotak. The ni okay, nineteen. Fast feel, baby. Hell yeah. Mm-hmm. Fast killing is hell of a drug. Yeah. Koda isn't gonna... He's, he's not gonna fight fancily. He's, he's gonna fucking kill this Greek. Fucking no, right. shit. Yeah, flanking. His name is Sir Squigholms the Third. Because his name was forgotten when I first said it. Sir Squigholms the Past, very shortly. It's true. Arcane Strike? Oh, I'm gonna still be fighting this guy. Just a casual Hell Arcane yeah. Strike. That will slam and jam. Hey, it makes it count as magic. It does, which means you ignore uh, most of my DR, actually. <laughs> you ignore all but three of it, but you get plus three damage against enemy. Oh, I'm not in shield. Okay, so yeah. 
if you had that plus three damage, you would have ignored pretty much everything. But nice. uh, otherwise, I I have three DR, so that's sixteen damage coming my way. Okay. Really? I'm wounded too. <laughs> As the worm that's wiggles in annoyance, that one will also slam, causing me twelve more damage. As I wiggle once more in an annoyance. I'm gonna use that moat. All right. I was about to. I was about to offer it. <laughs> I was gonna be like, yeah. with an old dwarves tray. Would you like a moat, sir? <laughs> <laughs> That's a uh, first. Uh... Yep, it's first. Yep. First. And if you used again, stage. it would be second iterative. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. That's what I'm saying. That will <laughs> slam and jam for another fourteen damage. <laughs> he said something. I don't know what he they, said. They actually do speak a language. They speak Oklo. What? Do I know that language? I don't know. <laughs> Tell me these fuckers are intelligent. I, I mean, intelligence is a strong word, but they, they do speak it technically. <laughs> they speak a language. <laughs> yeah, I would consider that intelligent. I have a question. Yeah. I need Nakia to know what they're saying. I don't. Okay, go. Sorry, go ahead. If I push the attack, is it a third scheme then? Or third? Or is it still second? The iterative stage from the moats is its own thing, so pushing the attack would just be a second stage. I'm yep. gonna push the attack. Fuck this uh, guy. Fuck yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. You mean she saved the last one for Vapis? Yes. <laughs> that will miss. Ooh, um. Technically, could be saved if you have anything that can boost it a decent amount, but it would have to be boosted a decent amount. Yeah, and I don't really don't know its basic AC, so I'm gonna let that. Well, fall. you know, a 17 hits, but when it's not wounded, or sorry, a 17 misses by one when it's not wounded. You should uh, use another moat. Um, I kind of want to be able to carry Why one. Why not? Who else is gonna use it? Lapis, I guess. Um. You can use you can use the one. Well, I, you know what? Whatever, whatever, whatever. You do what you want to do. Just the front line's looking pretty thick compared to mm -hmm. stuff happening over there. But yeah. Yeah, yeah Lapis was considering helping with that. Okay. Whatever you guys want to do. Cody is gonna rely on his uh, his allies. He's gonna let it go. He's gonna pass his okay. turn. All right, Stella. Uh huh. This is where Cyber uses all the most weight. She was cheating the entire time. Uh, <laughs> what? I swear that she actually cheated. Oh, have the turns have tabled, Luxo. Always with me <laughs> being the cheater. Now <laughs> look at where you are. Tisk, tisk. When, when the developer cheated. Oh, no. Look how the seated have fallen. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, dude. <laughs> 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 All right, my this is a lot of fucking worms. Yeah. Um, and there's also another creature to be showing up at some point. As a reminder of what I said last session. Game stage. Yeah. I don't remember it at all. Smile. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I told you guys there's like wormy things that you saw coming out of that, but that was like another creature's also approaching. Okay. So. Okay. This is where the girl comes behind. <laughs> oh God, no! Just keep posting behind you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Came out of that hole. Yeah. Gets clowned on. Okay. Um. You know? I do. I am going to. How much damage have we actually done to those guys? No, I'm fucking not. Hey. Okay. Um. Sorry, actually, I have five different spell schools. I'm trying to... You know, I haven't used this spell yet. So I'm going to use this spell. I am going to up this. Bring extra... Oh, that school doesn't have that, so I don't need to. Um, let me, I need to double check up to still really quick. Is that an option? Well, 
Okay. Person. An additional die. Ooh. Mm. And I have two up cash. Okay, I'm going to add two more die to this spell. Up cash. And then I'm going to spend my daily, one of my four daily materials to cast without a check. All right. Oh, boy. PTSD from our last encounter? And I need <laughs> grit number six, three, and two to each make a DC 17 by yourself. I'll fail. Holy shit. Okay. Are you seeing the, the number rolled or the total? You were seeing the numbers. That's enough. <laughs> <laughs> they're both, they're both pretty three, sad. Dog. Okay, three, you're, one, seeing the, you're seeing the roll number rolled. Yeah, I see the roll. Okay. Yeah. It's like, uh, That's all we gotta see. <laughs> yeah, either way, it's still. Yeah. Uh, they do it all. We'll do something though. And mm -hmm. I'm I, I, before anything else happens. No, I only did this because I did not want to boost their their strength even higher. Mm -hmm. They're gonna spend a luck point. To re-roll. Let's go! They have lucky dodge feet. Jesus Christ. You may spend a luck point to roll re-roll a say that you have just rolled. However, you must accept the new roll even if it's worse. So the last Jesus. one obviously fails. This middle one fails too because you said a DC 17. Yeah. The top one saves. So number three saves. Uh, however, because they have used the luck point... Their other luck talent goes off, and all three of them now gain their temp luck score as temporary hit points. Jesus fucking Christ. Look at these lucky builders. <laughs> I didn't have anything to put those- I didn't want to put four points into, like, strength or something. It's like, you know, we'll put in luck instead. I, I was looking into building a, like, luck-based character, and it looks really fun. Yeah. I'm surprised you didn't give them, like, grab and construct and I did. I, I, these were talents, though. I, I had extra talent points, and I was like, you know what? I don't really want to put in other things. I have extra luck as a score, so let's just buy luck talents. Well, either way, let me double check. This is uh, does the player temp HP work for mobs, or no? I doubt it. Alright, I'll just manually update their HP then. Jesus Christ. This, this reminds me of the time as I was uh, I was laughing at your uh, monster... One of your monsters that had zero luck. And you were like, fuck him. <laughs> well, either way, you guys will see Stella manifest a little bit star like little, little crystal in her hand and consume it as a bigger one will appear in the air above them before shattering with like shards of starlight. The two that failed. Alright, so two and six. Good bleed off fifteen. Alright. And this cannot be removed for well, it's I'm not hardly to remove for four rounds if they're going to attempt to remove it, but again, yeah, that depends. Um Okay. Alright, my other action Are you casting necromancy I, over there? What if I am? I'm just weird. I think you are a necromancer. I'm a universalist. Yeah. I have a bit of everything. Fair enough. Sir. I didn't know you had the necromancer yet. Yeah. I've had it for a while. I just haven't used it yet. Well, first time for everything. And then, uh... Last time for everything. Cyrus, <laughs> for whatever reason, has a very dry throat and will shoot a single popper at <laughs> number four. <laughs> Oh, uh, fuck. Well, uh, number four will slam into him and deal ten damage. As they crumple into a dead heap of worm. Nice. Blech. Yeah, this bleed cannot be removed for a minimum of four rounds. Enjoy that, Sage. How d would I remove it? Because you said it's just harder. Not like they're going to remove it. I just, I want to know. Yeah, I'm curious. Uh, the wording of bleed... From necromancy, is specifically, this three is the same as normal. Three, blah, blah, blah. In addition, for a base duration, for one hour per amount, so four. 
this beam cannot be removed unless they make a skill check or use an ability that makes Oh, so it's your spell, spell DC instead of the base DC. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, sure. No problem. It's not. They're not gonna do it, but you know. I mean, yeah, for the future. Yeah. I mean, that's another bleed. That's fifteen bleed damage. That's true. That's a fuck time. Yeah. Crawling out of the eye, crawling down the ladder. No. I have a dash to do this, so spending stamina. No. And. Leave me alone. Let's see here. That's thirty there and then i had to climb down a little bit too so it's about extra 20 feet i believe so i need to be enough 10 feet yep. yeah all it's right gonna be enough. i'll be able to charge you but i'm not going Sound to charge you but if i do this for my pack tactics i will flank you fuck off ah, i'm fuck a worm off. and i have You're a beak i have a flanking me, beak and i like to bite 31! Okay, it's not gonna miss. Fuck. 4, because I'm flanking! Ow. 27 physical and 2 acid. Ow. So oh, the rude. physical is... Technically, the sneak is precision. Yes. Technically, it is precision, yeah. Yeah. So let me take the physical. Ow. Then the two acid and the five. I'm just going to do those together. So that's seven more damage. Mm -hmm. Ow. And I'm going to tentacle whip you because I'm a tentacle beast. Don't do that. I got to. That's a miss. That's a miss, yes. I'm sad. Ow. Cressel. Uh, Cressel is going to look around at the squishies and be like, you know, those look pretty squishy. And she's going to move on over to here and swing some axes at this here Grick. Who is flanked? A swing. That will slam. Live, live tree reaction. <laughs> a swing. <laughs> that will not slam, but I will slap it for uh, 18 reduced by 16 because of my magical DR. That's a shame. All right. Might as well just push the attack for a second. Slammy. Yeah, okay, carrying on. All right. From the darkness, something moves. Mm -hmm. Carrying on. Lapis. So we, we saw darkness moving? No. I'm just, just, just a... Uh, Here, I have to be sure. From the darkness, out of sight, from everyone, something moves. Did we hear it move? Uh, you guys can roll perception checks on your turn. Right. I, I think that's a good idea. I'll just, uh... Yeah, there's still an action. Yeah, just, just oh, moving. then I uh, didn't know that. Yeah. Hmm. Fair enough. I do like playing to... games where it's free. Yeah, no, I'm not going to do perception. I have uh, something I'm a bit more concerned about. <laughs> I'm going to uh, five foot step away. And I am going to shoot. Let's see, is that? It is not. I'm going to shoot that one. Jesus. Ooh, that's pretty yeah. good. Uh, which one again? Uh, This one. Yeah, that's a crit confirm. I like that. I like that you're critting the one that's about to flank me. Yeah, 48 but... fire damage. Pretty good. Jesus Christ. <laughs> As it is wounded. The minor crit effect? Yeah. I think it's on fire. To... Your application to burning. Yep, that's that's a burn of 3d6. So roll me 3d6. Gotcha. Come on, high roll. Ten dots. Nice. Alright. Could be better. There we go. Not bad. Nice. Not bad. Yeah, it is, um, I think, uh, exactly average. It's pretty close. Yeah, because it's I think it's ten point five for three six. Ah, uh, yeah. The, the sad thing is, Sage, mm. I discovered in my Friday group, we might need to expand the dot table for like the. For state. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Because it can go past thirty. It it was at twenty for my fifth edition games, and I had to expand it to thirty. <laughs> I I had to expand it again 
actually, but I haven't done it yet. <laughs> Anyways, good stuff. I'm gonna, I'm gonna spend the moat and shoot it again. Nice. Hell is yeah. It, it is next to my friend. I will slam it for 12. Hmm. You can do it again on your stage, too. I think I will do that as well. Yeah. I'll fucking do it up. Slam and jamming. Oh, wow. That will slam for 15 because my touch AC is hot garbage right now. Bizarre. And then you can push the attack for another stage, too. <laughs> I heard you wanted to kill people with a machine gun bow. Oh, I Hell can't yeah, you're dude. tempting me like this. Oh, no. Fucking do it the fuck I up. Need. Do it. Wait, 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 it, it oh, no! no. <laughs> Roll to confirm. It would technically be stage three, but yeah, that's not one. Well, it was... Yeah. Motes are separate, aren't they? I have a quick question. Oh, no, yeah. yeah, they're, they're separate. Uh, yeah, I, I, I completely forgot, because I'm, I'm used to running 5e. Uh, mm -hmm. If you are in reach of an enemy's attack... Does that provoke? Yes, yes, it does. Would you like to five foot step first, Lapis? They already did. I, yeah, I already oh, did. Oh, well then. I'm, I'm standing here. <laughs> Let me just. Uh, can he take reactions if he's in the middle of the birds? Uh, you uh, reach. So, yeah, the birds don't prevent you from doing anything. They okay. just uh, there you go. They take away all of your. Uh, yeah. It's, it's, what I it's a miss. I'll double check, though. Okay. Yeah. The, the technicals have 10 foot reach. I can't believe more, everything has reach. The bite doesn't. More, if they have multiple abs, the second action would technically be a second trigger. Nah, just the one. I didn't give him combat reflexes. I thought about it. Gave, sure gave him uh, five fucking luck feats and stuff. I did! <laughs> Look, I, I, I had way too much spirit and fellowship, and I was like, I don't want to put it in other things like strength, because that's also a 20 right now, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Well, this is about to be that's fun. Me. Yeah, right. Crick number two suffers 15 bleed. He's a sad little noodle. Fucking prick number two, yeah. And he's going to wiggle, wiggle his face to jiggle, jiggle. He's sad that he can't, he can't, he can't flank. He's sad. Actually, um, if he were here, would he be flanking with this guy? His 10 foot reach? Yes. All right. Uh, no, no. Not like a medium creature. I don't believe so. So I know yeah. if the uh, attacks, the reach intersects to the same location, it works, but it, uh, it's fucking weird. Well, no, the, That's for the large, partial, is, though. Yeah, your partial flanking is only on large or bigger. Gotcha. Medium creatures can't be partially flanked. Alright, well, number two is just going to delay till after uh, his buddy number three. I mean, they go right after each other. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Number three is going to a Slither Sliver. Really? He, he takes 10 damage. He does take 10 damage, yeah. He also provokes. Wait, he's not attacking me? Oh, wait, he has flanking against you. Yeah. What the hey, mind. are you doing? I, I would, uh, would delay till after six. I'll, I'll fix number two to after six. There we go. Now we're accurate. Number three is going to take 10 damage and then slap you. I didn't I didn't realize it was flanking against you. Anyways. Bite. Flanking. Yes. Slippy slappy. 24 for 17 and 8. And plus sneak attack. I will use Pyre's End to gain plus 4 deflection. That's an I important thing. Yeah. Uh, I could be a no. dick and use luck points right now. I'm not going to. But I could have been a dick. Technically, I don't think you can. Well, it's a good thing I wasn't going to do it in the first place. Yeah, because you have to basically I've... you have to do it when the roll happens. Yeah, and... yeah, and I didn't do yeah. it. And so, in the Grick wouldn't have known that I had this effect. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's fine. Regardless, I I yeah. made them so they only use luck points if they use lucky dodge, and then rare cases they use it for other stuff. Yeah, yeah, cool. So, That's fine. Yeah. Anyways, uh, I miss. I'm sad. Good thing though, because I rolled almost max on my sneak attack. Yeah, fuck that. And then I will tentacle slap you. Don't do it. Tentacle wiggle. Misses. Okay. He's there. One, one piece of advice on that advice right away. Because we are facing an enemy with something like luck points. Before we use our own reactions, we should do what DMs normally do to us and be like, is that all you got? 
and then use it because we have order of operation rules mm. to help. So it's yeah. like, oh, you use that? Well, I use luck. Well, you use luck? I use that. Yeah, that's not a thing. All right. <laughs> um, you will see the Grick will look outwards towards um, Stella, Jack, or Lapis. One of you three. D3. All right, Jack, you're the chosen one. The Grick will look out towards you. It's beak opening, revealing a strange glowing green light that seems to be somewhat mesmerizing. Give me a mind-saving throw. What the fuck? Hmm. Can we get a check to know what the fuck it's doing? <laughs> I'll be clicking the macro in a second, so. Oh, hey, yo, that's pretty sus. <laughs> That's... <laughs> Shut up, fuss up. I swear to God. All right, you must target me in any attacks. So you have to target number three. <laughs> they use this like an angler fish to bring creatures toast to them, and then they murder the shit out of them. Ah, I see. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah. 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 I was reading their lore. So uh, you were saying something, uh, Devil? I just about to consider using a lot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we just did. We just did. Yeah, you're right. You're right. No, no I'm fine. It's yeah, whatever. It's whatever. Anyways, yeah. No, I, I was reading their their lore, and apparently they the way that they hunt is they go into one spot, like hanging upon the slack plates, like the two that were hanging did, and like lure you into a small sense of security, and then they just murder the shit out of you. So I gave a lure ability. Anyways, that's that one's turn. We go to number five. Number five is going to bite the shit out of a D2. So. Crystal. Uh, qu question. This this is like, I'm not trying to push envelope here. Uh, would it know or be smart enough to know that it doesn't have flanking benefits on Nocta and thus wouldn't would still prioritize Nocta? Or Oh, you're right. I do have flanking against Nocta. I would target Nocta. Okay. Yeah. If I, so if I have flanking... Have if I don't not even if I don't know it, they they target those. Super yeah, that's 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 my point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's cool. Uh, we're really quick. The one in the birds would actually benefit from drinking. They just uh, uh, provide drinking or tactical purposes. I mean, I hit regardless. But do you want to provide me the uh, the wording because that would change if I have to say tactical. It's in hard. It, it's in general. Uh, yeah, in general. that that's okay. huh. Let me share a space with this creature to not provide flanking or tackle bonuses. This creature provides flanking. One, two, three creatures. So the second sentence is just, yeah, I remember. Yeah, for like, the birds to us. That's what the second sentence. Yeah. But the first one's important. Okay. It's a similar interaction to Nimble Flanker, where you count as being in a different scale for bonuses you benefit from, but not you provide. So. Oh. That's Weird. interesting. Alright, well, uh, because of that, Anocta is suffering from 18 physical, 5 precision, and 4 acid. I'm sorry, devil. Sorry, Jack. Bye. That's what she's there for. That's true. So, uh, it, does the precision go with the acid? It's just it? precision damage. It would be physical, though. It would be physical hooker. Okay. Yeah. Right, it, bypasses it bypasses DR, yeah. 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 Precision damage is one of those weird things where it, it's typed by the biggest type of attack, but it bypasses DR and lands as a purpose. Mm -hmm. Yep. All right, well, that's my second attack, which is a miss. Uh, from there, we go to Ilfrin. Okay. Uh, well. Fuck. <laughs> I don't know what to do. This is actually kind of curious. Uh, I'm not gonna... So the modes refresh, first and foremost. Uh, the birds will continue their performance. That's easy. That's been fucking doing work. We deduct the number of rounds down to ten. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Mm. Still good position for me to be in here. Kind of put myself in a shit position. It is unfortunate. Hindsight's a bitch. Hindsight's a bitch. It is oh, 2020. Shit. You have a shield, don't you, Jason? Yeah. Uh, we forgot, but 
Sheer benefits are cut in half when you're flanked. That is true, but I believe even considering that, I the AC would have missed me by you one. You have 26, so, and then your shield AC would have been halved. Yeah. So I, I, it's I, only a plus uh, 2 bonus from my shield. Yeah. I'll double check. Yeah. That would still been a miss. I just yeah. mean for great. And you get benefits you have just. Yeah. You would know that. Keep that in mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. Oh, uh, man. This is a real shit position. It is unfortunate. God damn it. Give me a perception yeah. check if you want. Well, that would require an action, would it not? True. I am using your passive otherwise. Tempt me not with your foul <laughs> temptations, you <laughs> tempting temptress. <laughs> why temptress? Fuck you, that's why. Anyways. <laughs> Man. Yeah, I'm Just sorry. Just kill I'm it. I'm being real wishy-washy here. Uh, well, the birds are easy. They're gonna five-foot flap over here and do their minimum damage to this dude. Yeah, so that's a uh, five non-lethal. Oh. Yep, that's three non-lethal. Oh yeah. Let me send this to the back here. There we go. All right. Fuck. Damn. It. This is like a puzzle I can't see the next move of. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, what do I do? I gotta just step down, I suppose, but then he'll just step back into flanking. If I step down there, we'll do that. If I step there, that's probably gonna be for the best, actually. You'll be relatively safe. I got the birds covering your flank. This is curious. Alright, uh, I'm gonna find a step here. Well, hmm. <laughs> I hate this puzzle. This puzzle sucks. I'm gonna five a step here. It seems better. It does seem better. Well, do I want to do something before I step five a step? That dude is pretty damn injured. That dude is pretty damn injured. You know what? I'm gonna trust that you're gonna be able to deal with that in your turn. Um, I'm gonna five a step and punch the shit out of this one to my left. <laughs> Yeah. I made up my mind, guys. Don't worry. All right. Gas I, defense lead. Extend cast. Uh, no, DC okay. will be 10. I gave and me I was making recently step up, so I had to make sure, but I did not. Okay, we're good. Yeah, fuck off. Fucking right. step up. Oh, also, I gained four health, I believe, from fast dealing. Nice. Boom. You're punching the one to the left, number six? Yes, I am. Uh, oh. Casting defense lead. I'm making the check for the spell now. Excellent. Mm. All right. So that's uh, 18... Touch for 19 piercing. That will slap and me. I rolled again for the second. Oh, that's a one. That's a confirm roll. Uh, can spell attacks fumble? Actually, they only fumble on the uh, conjuration check, right? Yeah. yeah, so, that, yeah that that's just, that's just a miss. Before. That's just a miss. Okay. God, look at that damage, though. Fuck. That would have been nice. I'm going to change three, and that is my turn. I made it my mind. Yay. All right. From there, we move on to the jack. The uh, Jack is going to attack t the uh, Grick 3 because can't do anything else. Oh, yeah, right. I could just rely on that. Oh, I didn't know that in character. So, I guess enjoy your popper. Popper, I hardly know her. <laughs> Not the fast heals. That's true. Alright. Popper's going on who? Grick 3. I can only attack them. Gotcha. Yeah, that's true. That is true. Alright. That would be Tan Damage. As you kill him. He's sad. He died on himself! <laughs> he did. Uh, Naka is going to once more attack Grick 5. All right. I approve. Enjoy your flanking. Oh, that's right. Flanking. Yeah. I do enjoy. Mm. I, I don't enjoy rolling. That will blows, miss. But... That will hit. <laughs> Damage blind. Lovely. And, uh, yeah, Nocto will go ahead and push the attack. All right. That will hit. Damage blind. 
has two paws to swat at the rubbery noodle that is the Grick. That one will hit, but not confirm. Unfortunate. For another yes. rubbery noodle. Blah, 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 blah. All right. Oh, Doctor's just going to kind of look at this Greg. Like, what? Why are you still up? Stop being up. <laughs> Before I possibly get smacked, um, do they have severed weapons? No. I'm gonna heal for nine because I have DR silver. Uh huh. That I was forgetting. <laughs> All right. Anything else? If it's okay. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. It's okay. He's gonna flank me. It's true. Yeah. Life suffering. All right. Well, we go to number six. Number six immediately suffers 15 bleed. Number two, I already suffered 15 bleed, but they will be going directly after number six. Um, and they are going to... They're going to basic action, tentacle slap you. 23 for 15. Who's that targeting? Uh, Ilfrin. Not Nocta? Oh, they do have flanking against Nocta. Yeah, no, that Nocta. I keep, I keep forgetting that that one exists. Yeah. It's just that the, there's okay. technically it's not benefiting from flanking, but it is flying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So 23 against okay. Nocta for 15. That will just barely hit. All right. And because of that, Ren triggers. Uh, 27 and 27 for a total of 13 and 7. Holy fuck. Those will both hit. Can you my dice are hot. Alright, and then I will ready my... Oh, wait. Uh... Yeah, it was quick action and one action to do the tentacle. I will ready my other action, which will be push the attack for my bite against I did that wrong. Ilfrin um, when I get flanking. These motherfuckers are intelligent. I told you. I know, but fuck you. Specifically with pack tactics. If they were not pack uh, tactics, they'd be idiots. Yeah. Which is uh, minimum damage for them? Uh, minimum damage for them would be... The tentacle would be seven. Okay, so... Did you take his, uh, okay. his bleed damage, by the way? I did, yeah. All right, okay. this one steps to here at the start of their turn. Uh, start of their undelay turn, which will then immediately trigger this one's step push the attack bite. No. That is a 21 to hit. That is a... Oh, fuck. It's barely a hit. Okay. Well, I'm going to go ahead and uh, pirate end that. All right. Pretty good, pretty good. Uh, number two will then take its full turn to bite and tentacle slap you, Ilfrin. Okay. Yeah. see okay. what you got. Yes. 18 to miss. That's a miss. And then tentacle slap. It's a 29 for 14. Oh, this is going to hurt. <laughs> yeah, that, that's going to be a hit. All right. Uh, so, bludgeoning, 14. Cool. And because that is a flanking, yep. sink attack. Yep. And that will rend. Uh, which will, 24 for 12. Uh, I will go ahead and use my powers, my second power's end. Nice. And then uh, miss. That's misses. Oh, that could have been way worse. It could have been. All so right. bad. No attack. But Ilfren looks unhappy. It's a flank train. <laughs> You're gonna regret that. <laughs> You're gonna regret that. <laughs> You're gonna regret that. <laughs> um, smack. That will slam and jam. For 20 damage after the Arvid. Alright, the worm's um, pretty injured. I am going to spend. Uh, well, he's wounded now. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, I'm gonna spend one salmon on that, just in case he has some bullshit. So. Yes, um. 17. 17 to hit. Uh, because my wound, that will hit. Nice. Good fucking job. Hell yeah. Damage applied. He has minus one AC now. Aha. Uh -huh. 
I'll just manually add that. Bueno. I'm gonna need some notes. Better get better. Yeah. Hop off, King. 26. That will slam and jam for 20 damage. As the tentacle noodle thing wobbles once more in pain. Blah, 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 blah. Tricks are fun. I'm gonna use a second mode. Ooh. Well, I don't have an, I don't have two attacks of machine, right? So I can. It takes attack oh, well, opportunity. It doesn't, it doesn't, and also you still have your push the attack left, so you can do that first. Yeah. Where yeah. It leads you. Uh, that is unfortunate. Hmm. Add anything to the roll. Uh, damn it, I don't have... It's somewhere. Uh... No, it is just a free action. Mm. Look at that. Huh. For what? For the moats? Yeah, for the moats. Yeah, I know. Yeah. yeah. I know guard is a defensive action, so I assumed it would be a com... Uh, Reaction, but well, no. well, guard was way more powerful. Because this one helps you kill. That that one, it's like negate, like crit negating. Like yeah, yeah. I'm going to spend three stamina. Bring that to a sixteen. Holy shit! Yeah. That will slap for sixteen damage. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. I am so squished right now. All right, very good, very good. Anything uh -huh. else? I'm just gonna look at the initiative really quickly. Uh, mm -hmm. Can I use second mode or how to? Okay, if you use work? another mode, it would be at a stage two. But yes, you can. That's free action. And also just sit and wait, or you know, uh -huh. slap something else like throw a hammer at the one to the north. Well, he already used all of his attacks this turn. No, that's that's just <gasps> frayed up miss. Roll confirm. Oh, and you're using your moat to do that. Yeah, they don't have any th yeah. other things to do it. Yeah. So that does confirm at least, but it is a, right. it is a miss. Ooh. All that right, passed. Stella. Um. Well, first, I have five foot back here. Actually. I have stagger step, so I'm gonna five foot back here. <laughs> and then. Uh, I don't want to spend more mana, so I'm not going to. But I am going to uh, number five. Give me a body save. For five of the body save. I am blind. There he is. All right. <laughs> Body save. 20. Th uh, number. I rolled an 18. I pass. Yeah, at least it's, a plus two. It's 25, isn't it? It's not 25. Mm, okay. Uh, 21? Great okay. number one. Stop. Number it's one. That will touch attack slap me. For five damage. And then, uh,. I have an action, so I am going to perceive the darkness. I suppose I have an extra action. All right. All right. Let's see if I see anything in the flickering shadows of the firelight. Let's see here. With an 18, you would notice the hole... It's kind of like around the, the base of the statue. The light from your torches is, is flickering off and kind of like reflecting a blackest um, wall. You think thought at first was just shadow and then you see it move and get closer, slowly slurching its way up the pit. 
Airplane contact something bigger is coming from behind you. Alright, that's my turn. Now, Greg, number one. Let's see if I. Lovely. Did I give these guys the flanking feet? I'm pretty sure I did. Nimble flanker, I did. Cool. Okay. A step! If I stepped here, yeah, a way for me to five foot step would be you, so. Five foot stepping, and we're gonna flank Ilfren with my nimble flanker. I'm considered here. Not? Could you fucking not? I wanted to attack Hotak. It makes you feel better. Could you not? I'm rather injured. Oh, uh, here we go. Yeah. Fuck. And sink attack. Can you just calm the fuck down? Okay, so fifteen physical. Ow. Ten acid. Do we have acid res? We don't. You no, did, we... and it's gone now. Fuck! Yeah, we did, and you so, eight. I would oh, like to this is the second time we haven't refreshed your existence and immediately faced it. <laughs> wow. That's, that's right. on, well, I'm see, going I've high on used, every attack. You see, I, I've already used both of my reactions, my yep. defensive actions this round, so it wouldn't have even mattered, but it would also wouldn't have mattered because of how well you're fucking rolling. I've been rolling fucking hot as shit. I can see the future! So <laughs> you're, you're not defeated, you're just disabled? Well, I am disabled. I can... Oh, you're right. Okay, you are disabled. Okay, okay now you are defeated now. That's good, because... Um... Okay, I did give them that feat, but you guys don't know about it, so... Carrying on. Alright, we're gonna... I did give them Savage, yeah. They It only triggers if they see you go down, and they see you get brought back up, but, uh... I five-foot stepped, and I will instead tentacle attack... attack. <clears throat> Wait, Rend only triggers on the same target, so I, I just end my turn there. <laughs> I would have rendered for two more attacks, but since you're defeated, they can't target you. The carry through would have been brutal, dude. Yeah. I would have lived, but it yeah. would have been I mean, just for funsies. Another, Get out of here! It would have been Get another, it been another twenty. Oh and my twenty! No, damage. it would have killed me. I would have taken yeah. a death. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! It would have been a confirmed crit too. It would have been fucking forty oh. damage the second one. Oh my god! <laughs> carry on. Good wrestle. I don't um, know what Nazi felt like. You fucking not. Oh no. Uh, Kressel's you know gonna summon some allies. She's gonna cast defensively. Here we go. Okay. She succeeds in casting defensively, and she's gonna cast the spell now. She. There we go. She. She's sad. She's just. She's just outright sad. She's going to spring a bit. I'm going to. She succeeds. Man, uh. <laughs> Seven. Here we go. All right, I'm gonna grab some piggies from the other map. Point. Do you like my new name, by the way? Sick of point up, <laughs> Nazi <laughs> it's, a, it's a sign of solidarity. <laughs> what do you mean? All right, you're needing the most help, so we're gonna pop a piggy here, and we're gonna pop a piggy here. I hope you die. I'm gonna take that fucking ring. <laughs> yeah, I fucking dare you. All right. Uh, starting with this piggy. You can't, you can't take the ring off my dead finger. I would be alive. I will burn your corpse. That piggy will slam into it for. Um, the ring would revive me. Five damage. And then it would be gone. <laughs> and this piggy will slam forward. Okay, I need. Oh. Does not confirm the fumble. I'm gonna push the attack on this piggy. My dice. Okay. But the one I'm working for you guys and my dice say no. We're gonna push the attack on the other piggy. Yeah, okay, my dice my dice just say no. I, there's more bodies at least to help you guys take some attacks. And Cressel will then use her other action to just flip this thing off because she can't attack. Yeah. Yeah, she doesn't have anything else she can use with her other basic. Alright. The black slurging thing slurges forward. Rage, you said it was for a different group. You bastard. You lied. <laughs> you lying liar who lies. I made it for a different group, and then I was like, the one I think, the thing I actually made was worse. 
So I was like, no, nah, we're using this one instead. Do we know what you made originally? Yeah, it was a cave drake. I oh! Made a random report back. I mean, would you though? Yes! Would you? Yes! Well. Didn't I do it for you? <laughs> That's the voice you're doing it in. <laughs> would you? <laughs> That's fair. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways. Anyways. Plus, this one gives you times to run away if you need to. But uh, it yeah, will I'm slurge forward to right. there. Um, I Let believe, time-wise. With all the necromancy and shit, the black pudding makes more sense. Yeah. I suppose. Yeah. Yeah, no, the cave drake was related towards the goblin tribe that was here, and I was like, you know, because of the wendigo and all the necromancy stuff, we'll, we'll do this instead. But, yeah. So I went for Grix and Monstrous Beasts and stuff. Thinks it would be more of like a, a Goblin Tribe that took over. So, anyways. I search forward to here and then I have... How much movement left? And if you'd climb up. Means I have one action remaining. Okay. Well, that's just unfortunate. Uh, you're exactly within 15 feet of me there, Kotak. My reach is 15 feet, so I'm going to slap you with a tentacle. Okay, 23 to hit for 14 bludgeoning and 6 acid. I'm slapping you for 20, uh, 14 bludgeoning huh. and 6 acid. Well, I am going to attempt to parry if that's possible. Yeah. Can I parry this big guy? Cause no, he's oh, wait, like you're right. I am huge, aren't you? You do have parry rules against that. And yeah, no, you just can't parry. If you had a shield, then it's potentially there's possible. Specifically, a kite shield. Yes. Or if you have the tan. Oh. Or a yeah. Or... yeah. There's a few different weapons that allow it, but yeah. Yeah, no, it's, just, it's just unfortunate. Well, that is slamming to you for 14. A bludgeoning, six acid. Get a check. One then acid. Yeah, what's the damage check on this creature? A dungeoneering. Fuck. <laughs> All right, and because I hit you with my uh, tentacle, I get an immediate grapple attempt against you. It's my grab feature, which is oh, no. an advantage, so plus nine to grapple you. The advantage is a 25 to grapple. This is a CMD check, right? Yep. You're Come on, man. That, right? I was expecting into that shit. Come on, man. I don't know where it is. Uh, <laughs> uh, more skill, right? No, wait. No. I, where is it? <laughs> It's on the token blind. somewhere. It's on the, uh... I have it in my combat section. It's in but... campaign. Yeah. Campaign's also... combat CMD black button. Yep. Right next to Vitality. I don't have it, I think. Okay, I'm oh, okay, just Okay, so go to the campaign tab. Yeah, go to there. the campaign window, yeah. Unfortunate. Yeah. Alright, well, yeah, you are no. grappled. Well, the that, same bonus. it should be more than a nine, but yeah, I don't think it's a yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, is it? Um, is it ten more than nine? <laughs> <laughs> a little on the nose there. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what you got. You could have just spent uh, XP on CMD. My uh, my CMD total is uh, ten, twelve, fourteen. I have a plus 14 CMD. Oh, damn. 24 off. You have 21 showing. Yeah. Yeah, no, I can't, I can't buff it anyways. No, no. Well, uh, I do grab a hold of you, and then with my other tentacle, another pseudopod will sloop out and slap you. I'm pseudo your pod. <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. It's for you to find out. That is a critical. 
Plus a 20 confirm. Please say no. Uh. Wait. Oh, I'm putting that in my next one you confirm. I'm like... No, it's, it's a 20 with my bonus. Let me still look for my sheet quickly. Uh... Nah, I can get up to 19. But, uh. Yeah, well. Alright. Unfortunately, that is a confirmed crit for 34 bludgeoning and 28 acid. Uh. How much bludgeoning? 34. Also, I can choose if it's acid or uh, bludgeoning for the crit effect, yeah, or no. Or it's usually whichever which main one is. The, 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 the main okay. Damage. Well, how much is it? Sorry, how you... uh, twenty-eight acid. Wait, the acid crit? Isn't I mean it's part of the main attack, isn't it? So what? Oh, it's, be... it's a natural acid. Yeah. yeah. For, okay. I'm sorry, Kotak. Jesus Christ. Oh. Well, front row just got wiped. Well, fortunately, um, your DR is only lowered by one, or uh, by two for one round. Mm. I, I don't think I have yeah. enough bombs, guys. All right. Demo, focus on hearing or do what I can. Yep. Yep. I, I just hit like a fucking truck and I'm over here in land of sadness and that's what we're gonna do with my my black pudding, lapis. Hmm. Hmm. All right. It is not engineering check to learn about it. Um, I, I will be twelve. Yeah, twelve's not enough. Yep. I I think my actions are better used trying to equalize this action economy. Yeah, they're the grips, hundred percent. Five foot step away from Greg five, fire at Greg two. Uh, no, thank you. Greg two, you said? Yep. Oh, uh, what is your, you have proficiency in heal? Uh, me? Yeah. I do not believe I oh, Well, that arrow will kill it. That was code for the bleed would kill on its turn. Yeah. Mm. It's fine. Yeah, fair enough. I had one HP left. I <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, uh. have known. And I'm going to spend them out to shoot the other one. Mm -hmm. The plowy. The other bleeding one or the one with the birds or this one. Okay. Rick six. Bleeding one. Cool. That will slam into me for nine more fire. I'm wounded. They don't have a push on them. Um. Yeah. Yep. That will. I think to the total. Before I reveal results. What? Are you going to add anything to your total to hit before I reveal results? Um. No, I'm happy with a 16 touch. Uh, oh, touch. Okay, no, that. that yeah. yeah. I was like, it's, it's missing me by one otherwise. Yeah. <laughs> I was just like, if 16 isn't hitting with the touch, something has gone wrong. Yeah. All right, that will slam in me for 24. I'm now doubly wounded. This is the point I would like to remind everyone the overexertion rules exist. We probably need to use them. You can get extra actions, attacks, we will entire change of checks. Yeah, I recommend we consider All right. using anything else. Play. Um, for the extra action, uh, what's the rules for or exertion on that? If you can. Why are they in the book so I can bring them up? Let me control F. I don't. Rem I should have done that myself. Wherever you put them. Yeah. Uh, they are on page four eighty nine under stamina. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. Alright, you're gonna attempt to push yourself beyond what would normally be achievable at the expense of risking exhaustion in life. Whenever you would overexert yourself, you can choose to gain with the benefit of an exertion boon, making a vitality check with against the DC of the boon desired. Plus one per overexertion made in the past minute. If you succeed, the boon is gained. If you fail, the boon is not achieved. 
Success or fail, at the end of the combat or scene, whenever overexertion is used, you must make vitality check each time the feature was used in that combat or scene, with a DC of 10, plus 1 per additional use. Um, resetting to 10 after a complete long rest. Failing gains you a permanent loss of 1 max stamina. If you ever reach 0 maximum stamina, you die. I only have 4 stamina, so I am going to... Not start yeah. overexert myself. Yeah, overexertion is a gamble because if you do fail by, by follow up by vitality check, it will lose max stamina. Mm -hmm. But it can give you bonus movement, can give you double attribute bonuses, can let you reroll stuff, can let you do additional action for a round, and can let like, you do additional attacks. Yeah. That'll be my turn. All right. A uh, Grick has gained initiative. His name is Fizbin the Mystical. Holy shit. Oh, no, not And he's going to flank Nocta because he's got flanking, but he doesn't because he's sad. No, he does. He does. Oh, he will flank Nocta. Fuck. For 23 That's physical, like, 7 you're... acid, and 10 sneak. Strange. Can you not? I would like to, but I might die say yes. Stop complaining. It's not a critical. <laughs> yeah, it could be worse. Could be worse. Could be worse. <laughs> Uh, at least they're attacking Noctu, who's just an HP tank. Yeah. <laughs> like, if I was attacking, fun. like, Jack, it would be much worse. We don't want the healer to go down right now. No, we do. Alright, well, I'm on a tentacle slap now. You're not. Oh, yay! You didn't! <laughs> That's true! If you're wondering, by the way, uh, my tentacle is built in using the penalty for uh, being a secondary natural weapon, so... That's why I'm not doing like secondary attacks or anything like that with it. It's, just, it's already taken the negative. Um, and that's a miss, so I'm just a sad banana. I could push the attack with my other eight basic action. Um, sure, we'll push the attack. We'll push the attack on my tentacle. No, okay. No. Ilfrin. All right. I believe you're currently defeated. I have made up my mind. You have seen healing. four of my dudes. Yes, indeed. Unfortunately, you I don't know if this helps or not, but it happens. It does, because it may be important. Um so defeated. I I have not yet to drop my items, correct? I'm not unconscious, so Indeed. You just okay. have one action. Okay. And any movement is hacked. One action, huh? And a Fred for step would be that. What page were those rules on? Um, Defeated condition, I believe. No, no, no. What page? No, what page is the uh, exertion rules on? Oh, uh, page two seventy, I believe. Or uh, uh, guy. I posted a picture of the actions. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he like did. Four eighty nine is yeah. the starting page. It's not all it takes, but it's the, the actions. Yeah, I should add an over exertion thing that says you ignore. Defeated for a round or something. Probably. For a minute. That'd be cool. Yeah. Maybe we can deal with that. Okay. Yeah. So you said it was two. Wait. What? Okay. What page of which book? 489 of the player's guide. 489. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So it's a vitality check against the DC listed in the boon. To gain the effect of it, and you can just attempt it as many times as you want. Just it changes how bad it's going to be after the end of the combat. Oh, so having one action, so I have one base action. Does that mean I have a quick action as well? No, no, it, it's just one action period. <sighs> mm, being defeated is pretty pretty sad. Yep. It also means if you heal yourself, you're still defeated because it's start of a turn is what your actions are determined by. On the plus side, at the end of this fight, you guys are probably going to be journeyman rank. <laughs> yeah. So, does or having or only one base action mean I cannot take free actions? No, you can take free actions. Okay. 
If reaction is not a consumed action type. Ilfrin will five foot step. He will look to the array of threats and abominations before him as he uses his action to retrieve a Spear of Healing Mist. Mm. And he will say to them, I will not be dying here today. And as a free action, he'll drop it. Does it shatter the Spear? You're dropping the Spear from a height of... How tall are you? Uh, fucking, one second here. Uh, six and a half feet. Okay. Let's find out if the sphere breaks. Oh my fucking god. Yes! Okay. Cool. Roll the two or lower. I was just, if it didn't, I just was gonna attack it. <laughs> so, boom. That is where the healing mist is. Oh, you're healing a piggy. Uh, do oh, I, nice. Do I, uh, go ahead and roll it now? Like, what the, for this round? Because it uh, says, uh, 3d8 positive energy for four rounds in a 15 foot radius. Yeah. So this will be one of the four rounds. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the start of your turn, every round, it will be doing this. Oh, wait, wait. Fucking, right. what was it? 3d8 plus 8. Okay. 3d8 plus 8. How many of those did I give you? Um, I only had one on my person, but yeah. there's more on other people. No, Crystal Holy has the last one. Yeah, I think there's like one there. Oh, look, look at that roll. That, that, was, that was almost max. That was a good Holy roll. fuck. Went off. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking A, dude. Yeah. There was ever a time for it. Crystal Holy shit! One spear. <laughs> Holy fuck! <laughs> <laughs> fuck you, Greg! See my asshole! <laughs> fuck! I'd just like to point out that this plan of me focusing on healing is really working out. At that point, bomb the fucking sign. All right, uh, the birds will. Uh, holy shit, dude! That's All right, nice. well, the birds are gonna are gonna move up. Uh, let me think. They are currently swarming a Grick. Yeah. Which, I know. Uh, by the way, I'm gonna heal the Grick up real quick. That's fine. Yeah, it, that's it, it. Had to happen. It I did. don't care. It did. <laughs> no fucks to give. Uh, they're gonna go ahead and, and move up here. Uh, which provokes from his him and him, I believe. Yeah. This Grick will take a little bite, or not an acid spit, a bite. Okay, uh, so let me do go ahead and do that damage. That's half the physical, and then nine acid. And then this Ow. one will attempt to bite. God, they're going to go down. Fucking A, dude. Fucking A. Didn't think you were going to do that much fucking damage, dude. Jesus Christ. Look, my d dice have been fucking hot. I've been rolling nothing but, like, 15 plus. <laughs> yeah, that was dumb. That like, was dumb of me. I just rolled a 19 for the second attack. Yeah. I saw. That sap, oh. that would be nine. And a little, a little and, insane. And six acid. So they're defeated. I think their their uh, performance still continues despite that. That's fucking brutal, dude. It's pretty brutal. Jesus. Yeah. All right. Well, that's yep. All right. All right. Jack. Well, Jesus unfortunately, Christ. I can't see the uh, slime to the the black pudding to hit that with the bomb. It's I outside can. of line of sight. It's outside of my uh, actual line of sight. It's in my low light uh, area, yeah. which I don't have low light area. <laughs> gotcha. Wait, you're in front of me. You should be able to see the edge of it. it it's outside of my light source. Well, light sources are. If you click on your token and you can see it, you, you can see it. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, like I mean, it's, it's in shared. dim light, but yeah, you can see it. I also think it's immune to fire, but. <laughs> I mean, do what you want to do, it's there. Are there other resources? How are we looking health wise? There's only one way to find out. Technically, two way. Uh, I think I'm actually going to uh, hit Ilfrin with a, a healing bomb, actually. Because hmm. I don't want us to drop suddenly. Yeah. Although this is for three rounds. Hmm? That's a. 
Honestly, you might want to hit Toad Deck. Because he's grappled currently. By the slime. Yeah. So. He also has technically two wounds. Yep. He he has endurance, which is why it's only showing one. Same with Code Tech. Well, that's oh, why I was saying Code Tech okay. is. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They burst you. Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna hit. Uh, Kotak, mm. I think. All right, all right. Talking about the fact that we both have endurance. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he was just saying he needed to heal, and they went with Kotak because he's grappled, and who knows what that would do at the start of the slime's turn. Yeah, indeed. If you're grappled, mm. are you considered flat-footed? <laughs> no, no, you're not. Is there a feat that does that? Uh, I think there is actually like a journal, professional yeah. rank. Oh my god, big brain, big brain. Oh no! If you no, you and Elfin have a huge combo. The swarm goes in a person square to give you flanking on your healing brains. Yeah. Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> uh, so uh, you, you uh, heal fifteen, and then Elfin heals the splash. Uh, Elfrin heals eight or heals eight. Yeah. I would put in your bomb macro, by the way, just in like the third damage type, just a splash, so it's it's always listed. Oh, that's okay. Yeah, that's yeah. smart. Why did I don't I know think if Noctis is full health, but uh, fast healing. Mm. Mm. Dude, I just gave you fucking thirty-one health. <laughs> yeah, it's good stuff. You're being very oh, yeah, yes. got fucked up, so she might not be full health after. Alright, anything else for you, Jack? Nocta is actually gonna move. I can at the uh, di the, yeah. Uh, Nocta is going to uh, slappy slappy Grick. Which Grick? Oh, uh, Grick six. Well, that is unfortunately a miss. They have flanking. It's still a miss. Oh, okay, that one will hit. Damn it. That one will damage it. Yeah. Ah. Uh -huh. Anything else? And I'll push the attack. All right. That will slap me for minimum, of course. But you should think it's minimum. It is. This one will also slap me for minimum. Sadness. Mm-hmm. God damn it, I did yeah, I mean, when you guys heard about them earlier, I did tell you guys they had a thick map DR. Well, no, yeah, I just... After today, if we're alive, I'm going to be preparing a spell that all it does is make people's weapons count as magical. Mm-hmm. All right. Grick number six immediately suffers 15 points of damage. The bleed variety. And falls unconscious. Because of the uh, non-lethal it suffered. Nice. <laughs> Fucking, that's hilarious. <laughs> All right. And Kotak. You're grappled by this Chongus over here. Uh, are you healed for? Yeah. I hate to ask you. So. But did the slime not pull, it, pull him closer? I thought... I didn't know if they did that in Unbound. I know they do it in 5th edition. I mean, yeah, any creature that grapples can choose to pull him adjacent. I mean, it changes all the healing and shit, so... We're just gonna have the healing be the same. It will just, like, suction a shoot you right now. Start of your turn. Just, just so we don't have to go back on anything. Well, no, but, hey, the ears has a different one. It does it at the start of the target's turn. There we go. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go, Dag. Okay. Get over here. Uh, how does how does grapple work? Uh, just, you're, you cannot know. move until you break free. Uh, you have penalties to stuff. I'll grab you those penalties. Yeah. I know probably what I'm gonna do. I used. You know. Uh, here we go. 
Grapple is a tier 2 condition. You are unable to move away from your source of your grapple condition, and you have active reduction 2 and hamper 2 against anyone that is not the source of your grapple. In addition, you cannot use a two-handed weapon. You must make con concentration checks to cast magic while grappled. So, essentially you have minus 2 to a lot of stuff and hamper 2. So... Well, I'm probably gonna attack it, so, you know. Yeah. Minus 2 to attacks and skill checks, as well as minus 2 to AC and CMD. Yeah. Uh, is there an action to try to ungrapple, or how does that work? It is an action to try to break free. Is that a repel check, or...? I mean, you can attempt to repel check if you uh, use an action to do something, I believe. I believe you can make a CMD, right? You can also make a CMD. It's a CMD to just break free if you want to use an action to break free. Repel is... Um, like, if you are using a action to attack me, I believe you get a free repel check. But, uh, uh, it's not, it's not, it, it's any action you wouldn't be able to take. So, like, let's say you want to say, fuck it, I'm rocking in a basic action to move. You can then make repel as part of the action, but if those fail, it's still consumed. There you go. Type thing. It's not complicated, okay. but... Since you can attack well, even while grappled, you can't use repel then. Well, Koldo's gonna rage, because... Very good, very good. Letting shit! <laughs> uh, I gained 16 temp. I believe. No, it's con score, right? I'm checking rage. <laughs> See, I feel oh, if I had the, the Drake here, you guys would probably be much squishier right now. Yeah. Because I would have used a fire con on you guys. You have a fire con. Okay. Giving us a shit ton of resistance. Yeah, well, you know. I'm going to... Hmm... Yeah, I'm gonna spend uh, 38 mana. 38 mana, give yourself a temp HP shield. Yes. Uh, mm -hmm. It says on Rage that. Uh, Base stat. Uh, yeah. Take 10 pit points. Okay, so. 38. Well, you already so I need 19 temp HP. So I just remove 18 and then game must give myself the total? I believe you just type in gain 19 temp, it'll just add on top. We're no where are you? Yeah. yeah so you, you can just type in 19, it'll, it'll, yeah, there you go. Yep. It's good stuff. Yeah, um... Yeah, I'm gonna be safe. I'm just gonna lay on hands myself. Because, <laughs> uh... <laughs> That's a giant yeah, black it, button. I, it's pretty spooktacular. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm not wounded anymore. No tax. <clears throat> okay. I'm good, guys. I'm. I'm good. Um, and I'm gonna start swinging because well attacked. So. Are you raging? Yes. Yes, I am. Uh, oh. At. Well. I don't know how much wild attacks. How it does now. If it changed or anything. Uh, it's changed a bit. Uh, It's been a uh, since I looked at wild attack too. Let me scroll down to find it. Attacking. Attack actions. Wild attack. Uh, let's see here. My suffer a minus two penalty to AC and parry checks against your attacks, with an additional minus one for each attack made that round, including the first attack. So, um, so I've currently a minus three penalty to AC. If you attack me again, it'll be minus four, minus five, minus six, and so on and so forth. However, you also take oh. the same penalty, half of it, to your own AC. So right now you have a minus yep. one penalty to AC. But uh, all right, yep. well. That uh, is a 11 to hit me. 
correct? Uh, yeah. That will certainly slap. For 18 bludgeoning. You ignore 5 my DR. This is not... Oh, actually, uh, I need to roll a different one because I don't have Orkin Strike active. Oh, yeah. yeah uh, so I have to use a different macro. Yep. So I'm going to have to re-roll the damage. No worries. Give me that new roll. Uh, Cheater. <laughs> What's the same damage? Yes. Same damage. Cool. Okay. Damage blade. Wobble, wobble, wobble. As you slap the jelly with the hammer, it just kind of jiggles before you. Like jello. Yeah. I'll find one. Oh, oh yeah. Oh my god. It. I think yeah, it's confirms. Yeah, rip that crit. All right, that will crit confirm. Wait. What? Wait a minute. Oh wait, yeah, yeah it's, I'm a news. You're right. It, it, I'm, I'm immune. I'm, I'm amorphous. That's a slap, though. Uh, for damage. Sad. Yeah. Sad. yeah, but amorphous is a hell of a drug. I feel I've corrected you like five times this fight. You have. And it's not even trying to be an asshole. <laughs> but, you know, I think uh, this creature alone. Is two pa yeah, it's two pages worth of the obituary document for its stuff. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, and then I get on second stage attack with rage, right? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, do I push in that it's also two weapon fighting or pushing, or is? Just... Uh, no. you have to have a special talent to two weapon fight while pushing. Um. I note, uh... If oh, no. you are two weapon fighting, and your uh, rage bonus attack, oh. then yeah, you would mark it as a two weapon fighting. Not a two weapon fighting push, just two weapon fighting. Oh, yeah, yeah, for the bonuses, okay. right, my bad. Yeah. I mean, I don't yeah, think you're gonna miss me unless you roll a one, so I'm mostly just seeing for the damage. Yeah. So that is another... Oh, by the way, it's minus one AC because I hit it with two, two monkey yeah, yeah, attacks. Yeah, yeah, So right now my AC is three. Yeah. Uh, well, actually, it's it's uh, six, and then against you, it's even lower because you wall attack. But yeah, damage fly. Anything else? Uh, moat. All right. I'm gonna use some moat. Slapping my my ooze around, putting that that sounds horrible. Why would it? Oh, I love it. Uh, <laughs> <yeah>. Phrasing. <laughs> There's no way to phrase that. Well. No, nope, it's not. Yeah. It's not. <laughs> No matter what you say. I was in the middle of saying, I was like, I should not say this, and it was too late. It's already out. See, uh, it's just... even worse. Today in D and D, we sat around the table and slapped Sage's pudding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, confirm. Hello, confirm. hello, everybody listening okay. to the recording. Hello, <laughs> I'm the normal one. Nice to meet you. Are you though? Yes. Mm. I like I have Don't everyone even here. Air friends in the corner eating the pudding. Yeah. <laughs> in fairness, I have not slapped your pudding yet. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> uh, that, that seems like it's right. I haven't done it yet. Yeah, the yet was what yeah. did it. Oh, it was gonna... noted. My yeah. pudding is now well protected. <sighs> I'm looking at those moats still. They are squishy. Um, other people can use moats. <laughs> Oh, I know. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> All right. That's it. Stella. So, you want to know why I'd rather fight the Drake than the Ooze? Sure. Oozes are immune to most conditions. It's true. And early game, that's a freaking pain in the ass to deal with. Mm -hmm. I, I have no magic that's beneficial here. I mean... I'm gonna be honest. I'm still half expecting a Grick to come out of the eyeball carrying a torch. <laughs> this is when I just need to take the trait that I ignore ooze immunities. And yeah. Shoulda. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Okay, what? I, I don't even fucking know. I've been sitting here the entire time. Are they immune to bleed? Who knows? Well, I, the great users, I identified those. Are those immune to bleed? Yeah. Fuck. Are you to, open to suggestions for your partner? I mean, yeah, but what are they not immune to? 
is a bigger question. Like, what conditions? I mean, that's a long ask. Do you want me to just go through the fucking list? Well, I mean, they're immune to their baseline. They're immune to anything that's mind affecting because they don't have a mind. Okay, so there goes to your... Yeah, anything that requires a mind save, they're just outright immune. Yeah, and then they're immune to staggered days. They don't have eyes, so immune to dazzle? Uh, fuck. Choices, choices. That's a link. Choices, choices. By the way, you're immune to everything you do. Fuck. Are you, are you, uh, are you gonna be open to suggestions? I said yeah. Okay. To kill a fucking brick. We're still dealing with them. They're still a threat. No, like, specifically this one. I hate this one. <laughs> uh, I identified the groups earlier. What rank are they, Sage? They're journeymen. Of course, um, yeah. okay. <laughs> uh, sorry, Elfrin. Greg one is the cutest of all the Greeks. That's why I need to die. Hmm. Look at well, those eyes. Me. They're journeyman rank. What still has skill rank? Journeyman? Yeah, the plus four. Okay, that means they're immune to sleep. Uh, actually, uh, Kotek, how bad is the grapple for you? Um, I mean, it's, it's annoying, and, uh, I'll be honest, with nerf rolls, I don't think it really matters. <laughs> my, my rolls are popping off, that is fair. Yeah, right, so I, 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 Kotek will not go down, but he will probably be close at the start of this. You know, the storm. Well, you know. Well, or he could be dead. There's worse things than death. Doubt. Okay, I'm just going to double up past and spend a um, material to cast without requiring a check. Because I saved all those. And you double up cast? All right, one plus uh, highest per, or half highest link, please. I'm pretty sure. I thought it was one per spell level. Uh, hey, uh, before you do anything, I, I, I have a question. Yes. Because I remembered I could probably still do something. That would probably matter a lot. Uh, it's a free action to five foot step, right? And uh, I mm -hmm. can still make a repel check. No, uh, prime per step. I mean, it's technically a free action move, but you can't move after. Yeah, but you know, I've already used to try to find a step, but using the repel check, and if it fails, then it fails. If it doesn't, then yeah. Yeah, I don't lose anything, and I, you know, when I get in here, just you know, we haven't gone anywhere else, so just, I'm wondering if it's possible. I think there's some delineation Please. of a uh, of a meaningful action versus a non-meaningful action. Indeed. Uh, okay, you're right, so just half rank bonus. But, yeah, that's fine. Uh, and so, I'm going to extended cast them. And, up cast. And so this will be a DC, uh, 14. Destruction check. Alright. Okay. Well, what you casting? Uh, my starboard with an extra invigorate and an extra die damage. Mm. Uh, so there's an altering the damage. It is. I'm blind. Oh, I clicked on the wrong book. Oops. I clicked on the XP shop. Okay, it counts as a second spell. 
So that would be 3d8, 3d6, 4d6. Okay. Uh, grips number 5 and 1 both need a DC 17 body save. 5 and 1. DC 17 body. Alright. Well, you know what they're doing. Then in luck. They both still fail, but they get temp HP. Okay, uh, I'm gonna give them that temp HP real quick. Uh, they both take 26 damage. All right. Fire damage. Twenty-six fire damage. No problem. Damage applied. And then I'll pop her number one. And that's my turn. That's a touch attack. Yep, that will barely hit. Damage applied. All right. From there, we go to Grick number one and vengeance. They will murder. Uh, they don't have anyone to flank with. But they go um, to the They can flank with Rick 5. Yeah, they'll 5 except for flank murder. What? Yeah, they're in the birds now, and they're gonna murder the the, uh, the fox. Please don't. 22 to hit. Uh, hit. For 24 and 8 and 10, and since uh, this is first round time I'm getting the healing for the aura uh you gave everyone 23 healing for the the mist uh it was 31 31 okay One. healing for 31 oh, so wait that implies when they steps into it too it's first time first time in a turn or the start of your turn whichever comes first really okay yeah so if like Luckily. if if Jack walked in right now they would get healing because it's just well, that's healing for the round did not think that worked like that. It, 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 yeah. Sad. It's but, uh, a travesty of health. It is. It is true. I but, wouldn't uh, have recommended 20, attacking Brick 1. That 22 misses that. Nocta. 22 will miss? Oh, damn. And also, you're kind of cutting out a little bit robotic-y. But uh, I will try again with my tentacle. Yeah, I didn't know it worked like that either. Usually, if you're not in the area when it goes off, it goes off. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, pal. Is this better? It's better, yeah. Okay. As 18 uh, uh, total damage with 8 of it being bludgeoning, 10 of it being precision. 8 bludgeoning, 10 precision. Yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll go read it again just to make sure, but... I mean, it's, it's yeah, it just, like, I get it. Just, yeah. Not that I mean, it doesn't make sense, it's just, yeah. There, there, are, there are things that do do that. It's just... Yeah. Didn't know that one did that. Yeah. Like, a wall of fire and, like, stuff like that. Uh, yeah, what's minimum sense. damage? Minimum damage for these guys would be uh seven. Two plus seven, five. Nine, nine yeah, yeah, it is uh start of turn or if you enter the area during the round. Okay. Whichever comes first. You don't get it twice, so if you like start turn and then leave and then come back you don't get pop it twice you just yeah of course yeah yeah, yeah. all right uh, um pre precision damage still goes through though right yeah precision damage ignores the r yeah. and because i hit you ren goes off that will hit and two more hits for rage Stop. 16 uh, bludgeoning and 11 sneak attack, and then 7 bludgeoning, which would be reduced to 5 non lethal and 6 sneak attack. But from the looks of it, you're looking at. Yeah, that plus the, the sneak attack damage now. Yeah, that's 17. 17 sneak attack. Yeah. And that's my Greg's turn. Vassal. Um, Press is going to just acid splash this mud flipper in front of her. Cast defensively. Failed. She's sad. Well, she's going to high five Jack. And that's her turn. Yeah. Jack will high five Jack. The Black Pudding has gained initiative. At the start of the Black Pudding's turn, I must maintain my grapple against Gotak. 
Oh fuck! I actually have five acid res. Fuck! So, give me a CMD check there, Kotak. So I look to see if I have any bonuses with my my grapple maintained. Uh, I just have uh, the uh, just have the com advantage confirmed. Okay. So I'm a. Uh... I might want to do exertion here and reroll that, if mm -hmm. that's possible. Choices, choices. It feels like if I'm still grappling, it's going to be a bad time. Like, a very bad time. Like, uh, I'm going to get sucked into a bad time. Uh, uh, plus eight. What negatives do I have to CMD right now? Just a uh, minus two. Is it... So I, I should have... I should have steady ground, so I should have plus... 10, 12... I should have a plus 14. And a minus two, so I should have a plus 12. Right now. Uh, so I should have a 22. Unless I have... I don't have... Do I have wounds right now? You have what? Do I have wounds right now? Uh, do I get penalties from wounds that I'm not seeing? No, I think we yeah, healed I, I should have... You're healed up enough. You're, you're good. Yeah. So I, my team's CMD check. Yeah. Thanks. My CMD is 22 uh, total. Wait, you have... Oh, two I have a oh. plus 14. And Where I are you getting your... Your bonuses to CMD for being on steady ground. Wait. Say that again? Where are you getting the bonuses for being on steady ground? As uh, it's the uh, talent or isn't it your race thing? They don't have a race for it, that's what I'm asking. Uh five from strength, two from Dex, one from XP. Uh, uh, steady ground from would not apply from steady, for, steady ground would not apply for this. Okay, then it would be uh, plus ten or plus twelve. No, no, it would be at plus ten then. Because, What's the other uh, plus two coming from? Two. Uh, my buff. Oh, your your limber buff. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, you have plus ten total, which means that well, would, would be eight, 10, yeah. twenty versus twenty. All right. I assume I'm still grappled then. I mean, it's still uh -huh. there. Or whenever it's previous or something. Yeah. That's you unfortunate. Have uh, no. Oh. I might just have to spend over exertion here to just... Mm. Yeah, steady ground is only for things that are trying to, like, reposition trip or, like, bull rush you or things like, like that. Yeah. Not to grab hold of you. Yeah. Or I move. It's not moving me. So. Yeah, I'm gonna spend exertion. Uh, I think it's a. Uh, yeah. All right. Over exertion. So, well, give me a vitality check. Probably in campaign. Rolling? It's a CMD check. It's a vitality check. To over well, exert. Yeah, to re-roll the... Yeah, you have to make a vitality check to see if you can even re-roll. Yeah. You ended up using this action. Would I even be able to over use of exertion? Because yeah. re-roll ended up used in this action. That is saying that you are going to overexert to re-roll your CMD, which means oh, you make okay. a vitality check to re-roll your CMD check. That is the action that you're re-rolling. You have to take the new result. You obviously succeed vitality roll, so that's good. You can now re-roll your CMD. However, even if it's if it's lower, you have to take the lower result. If it's better, then you take that's it regardless. Fine. So regardless, this is what you're taking. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 
That is unfortunate. And I will mark you down for one fate check, essentially. Which is not fate in Unbound, but yeah. Alright. Well, that is unfortunate as the grapple is indeed maintained because of the maintaining of the grapple. You are instantly attacked and uh, per constrict. Uh, hold on. I'm going to need your action. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah. How far away are you? Let me double check. Ooh, wait. You might be They're 45 there. feet away. Yeah, let me double check my range. That might be just fuck. under the range. Fuck. I took... Yeah, so my... Unless you have artillery mage, I don't think they're in range. Well, I have bonus EMM, so they might very close range is five foot per two. Mm -hmm. So no, fuck. Never mind. Sorry, I thought you were really close. My bad. Continue. All right. Well, uh, you immediately suffer this damage, so that is seventeen bludgeoning and six acid. Yeah. Additionally, uh, Black Pudding's Constrict Attack can damage more equipment of creatures that has grappled. Any creature that has grappled by the Black Pudding suffers disadvantage. Any check or save may resist their own equipment being damaged by the Black Pudding's Constrict Attack. Which means, for you, uh, I need you to make me a body save. Uh, and this is for my equipment being damaged? Yeah. Yeah, that'll happen. All right. Your armor, your clothes, if it goes through your armor, which I don't think it will, suffers 17 bludgeoning and 6 acid. Does the new book have the uh, new HP rules? I'm pretty sure it does. Yeah. And there's even a damaging object section for more nitty gritty stuff. Yeah. Like certain, certain damage types dealing. More damage or something. Maybe. I'm gonna say it doesn't. What what's the uh, armor you're wearing? I mean, I'm wearing custom armor because. Well, well, okay. I'll just I'll calculate it on the side thing so I don't have to slow game down. Anyways, damage will be applied. I'll I'll just keep track on the side until I get it calculated. Um. Bludge. Six acid Kotek armor. Cool. Okay. Note it down. All right, that was my action to maintain. I still have other stuff to do. I'm going to slam and jam, I guess. Yeah, I think we're just gonna slam and jam. Um, I'm gonna just slurch my body onto you with my other action. I need you to make me a body save. Anything to your result before I reveal results? Uh, I can't buff this in any way, I believe. Uh, Alright. Uh, uh, I, I don't have luck. I can overexert to try to double my strength to gain more, I guess. Or you can but, uh, It's up to you. Man, I'm better at making quick decisions. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if I double my strength, I would probably. Be... Well, I'm like 18, 19. Mm. This is pretty big. I'm gonna let that lie. Uh, rise. All right. In that case, um, you are automatically grappled. That doesn't really matter because you're already grappled. Uh, and Black Pudding receives a free stage 1 tentacle attack and get made against you at advantage. If I already have advantage, I don't. I would get a plus 4 bonus on top of it. But I don't already have advantage, so just at advantage. Um, I may make this free tentacle attack every round so long as you are engulfed. I'll be re uh, describing more after I attack you. That has a 24 to hit for 25 bludgeoning and another 7 acid damage, and that will also 
then go to your uh, armor as well. Yep. But you get a body safe to resist it. Uh, you resist this one. Uh, I believe that's just a uh, safe or suck for the armor taking the damage. So yeah, you just completely resist that for your armor. You still take it for yourself, but, uh, but yeah. Five. All right. Uh, why, while engulfed in this way, you are blind and are unable to breathe. Additionally, I believe uh -oh. there's one other feature that I have that particularly is notable. Here's um, armor has ADHP, by the way. Oh, you did it, calculate. Thank you. Which means, what's his hardness? Do you know that? <laughs> uh, he's wearing generic armor, so I only use some 10. Okay. That means we're looking at that, so... Right, your armor's currently at 10 damage out of 80. I'll just uh, put it in your macro so you can do it for, for future shoots and whoops. Yep. Let's if everyone see. wants to link their armor in chat, I'll calculate it for them. My armor is magic. Wow. Wow. I assume uh, it gained in since the Lego. No. I think so, yeah. There we go. All right. Uh, let's see here. Uh, it damages anything that's organic. If it's sh uh, stone, it will not damage stone armor. What about steel? It damages or steel. Iron. Iron. Okay. It damages anything organic, metal, wood. Yeah. Uh, it's weird. Do, 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 do. So yeah, if your armor was a stone dwarf and stone plate, you'd be fine. Uh, constrict. Now that was, there's one thing specifically that I'm trying to find. There it is. Okay, that doesn't apply right now, but that one does. Okay. Uh, any hostile creature that shares space with this creature is automatically sickened by this creature crawling over their body. So you're sickened as well while you are engulfed. Gross. It's pretty nasty, yeah. Big peak time. Alright. And the rest are applied at other people's turns, so I don't need to worry about that. That was my other action. I have a quick action. My quick action will be to... Uh, you're going to go in my center now. Uh, I'm just going to use my quick action to make another tentacle attack for my Apex Hunter ability. I just realized, if engulfing makes you sickened, Oozes are primarily probably made up of vomit. No. Uh, I do have DR with this little buddy. They'd be nauseated. Good to not sickened. Okay. Alright, well, that is the Oozes' turn as I grapple the picky there, and we go to the top of round Flappus. Oh, that was attack was against the pig? As a pack against pig, yeah. Okay. You're already my buddy. I don't need. I don't need anything with you. Mm -hmm. So, attacking the Grix would. They're in the healing oh, thing, so. Raptors, uh, stagger with it. Will you shoot the ooze once to test something? Also, I forgot about this. Start my turn. I uh, have fast healing. Oh no. I have applied it. <laughs> yeah. I Lapis picks up what you're putting down, uses the Starlight Bow as a shot against the uh, ooze. One shot against the Black Pudding? Mm -hmm. 15 fire? Does it seem to do damage? It does damage. It oh. really good to know. Yeah? It's really good to know. Oh. Hey, we're in business. Indeed. Mm -hmm. All right, Lapis. Use all the moats. Burst it down. Yeah, see, I want to get within 30 feet because that adds damage. <laughs> but also, I don't want to be next to a thing. I'll so, so oh, this okay. one's unconscious. So, yeah, so but here's something. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Would you mind if I offered you a solution here? Go for it. Okay. Uh, you move. Uh, fuck, I don't have a way to show the line. Okay, so let me just gesture. Yeah, yeah, so you can move 30 feet, correct? 
Yes, I do have a 30 feet okay. movement. Uh, let me see here. Do some measurement. Yeah, that would get you. So, bam. Okay, cool. Uh, if you moved, uh, like so, you see 5, 10, mm. movement will provoke, you'd get hit, and then you get healed. So that's 15, True. 20, 25, 30, or 25, 30 here. So either one of these squares. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, you're risking hit by the crick, but even if it hits you, and, like, even if it crits you, Bruce God sure. fucking forbid, you're gonna be healed for most of that damage, like, yeah. immediately afterwards. My body yeah. will trip into the healing and then get back up. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Where are your yeah, private names? You're just going to get hit by both grips. Did you have uh, uh, I, theoretically, I can move under. Yeah, that'd be yeah, safer yeah. then. Yeah. 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 And you'd have to end up. You'd have to end up here though, if you want to be within thirty feet. I think. Uh, yeah. 10, 15, 20, 25. Because if you end up like, if you go like, actually, hold on a second. Also, is there penalties for moving through creatures? Their allies or. No, no, you can move through arrows. So, so yeah, you could you could go down here. That'd be yeah. I leave it up to your discretion. Yep. So provokes. As I move here. Let's see. Uh, do my attack against you. Get a little bitey bite. Yum 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 yum. Twenty eight for eighteen oh, and three. Yeah. I look. I, I I offer nothing but sadness. Uh, am I with him? Hang on. Let's see. 40 feet, so I'm not within the link. So that's, I that's actually a good thing right now, my opinion. Yeah, that's but... good. <laughs> mm -hmm. yep. right. Then that's 15. This you meet lethal for 31. Is, uh... I did uh, mention if you wanted to move here, you would actually be outside of the uh, natural reach. Yeah, yeah. I break way to the right. That is true. They wouldn't be able to get there, but they can get to here. Uh, they can get to here, yes. Yeah, they can't get to the top one. That's 35 feet to the top because, one. Because you would dip down 5 feet, and then that would be 10 feet to get there. Yeah. Oh, because I was at 25 when one, I was took, here. No, yeah, but you... You, you, you have to move movement. diagonal here. So, uh, watch. If you move your token back yeah, here, yeah. and you move it, and, and you, you hit a space bar through. here, and then you'll yeah. be able to see. Yeah. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You go one to the right. If you end here, you should be fine. But you won't be in the aura for next round. Yeah. Right, you can just you can enter. enter. Yeah. yeah, you can <laughs> just enter next round. It's, it's fine. Yeah. But yeah. I'm not trying to play a turn here for you, but yeah. Nah. And now... Fire seemed to do full damage to it, no, nothing... No, no special effects, just fire. Because part of me is wondering if... Oh, wait, wait, wait. There is one special effect. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, KO attack! You're about to get slapped. Why? Damage transference. What? Do we I... know that? Do we know that? You do know that now. <gasps> As you suffer uh, seven, right? Half. Yeah, so... you you would suffer uh, seven points of fire damage. So what I'm not fuck? going to uh, shoot the black ooze. For now, with all the moats, that doesn't Seven. seem ethical. I mean, it'll be fine. I have a question. Yeah. You said I'm, uh, I can't, you know, not breathing because I'm holding my breath. I took Correct. damage. Do I have to, like, make a save to not lose? No, whenever you take Air? damage, you just lose a round. Yeah. Okay. All right, so I have an important question. That's a black ooze. And he's blind right now, right? Yeah. How are we seeing him take this stand? Well, you saw him get dragged in. So he's still, like, partially... Because everything's going happening at the same okay. time right now. So he's, like, mid-getting dragged in, and the fire will kind of leap upon his body as he's pulled deeper into the creature's okay. form. Okay, making sure. So. Because I'm like, technically, we failed on damage to... Yeah. Mm. Okay, okay. You, you'd see the damage would laugh upon him. If you guys waited around and then did this, I probably wouldn't have clicked the macro and I just would have told him to take damage. But, you know. Alright, well, yeah. that's my turn. Alright. A great number what? five. I'm gonna flank this here, Nocta, because I got flanking. Also, I'm a happy little noodle. But doesn't actually have flanking. Yeah. Yeah. Just reminding. 
I'm a sad little noodle. Yep, that's my noodly turn. Ilfren. All right, everybody within this area heals. 19, not bad. That feel when I gave the Grix Apex Hunter and I haven't used it at all. Okay. It's fine. Not like I need to use it. Stage, mm. please. Like... Look, man, if they're ambush hunters, I tend to give them that feat. Um, okay, can somebody help me with moving the fucking birds out from underneath these fucking Yeah, birds? I got you. Thank you. There we go. If you uh, go right between the two of them, then it's there easy to grab. Fine. Okay. Uh, okay. So there, where they are, just for ease, I'm just, I'm just moving. There we go. <laughs> I like to uh, know... make them slightly larger than large. So if you do like something like this, uh, or sorry, like yeah. like this, that way they're always grabbable. Perfect. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Great. Okay. Cool. Uh, so at the beginning of the turn, the moats refresh. Fuck. Fuck. I'm gonna go ahead and say fuck one more time. Fuck. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Birds, easy. They continue their performance. Uh, they'll do um, their minimum damage to the creatures here. Uh, so, continuing just to whittle this one down. Yep. Uh, okay. <clears throat> what do we need to do? What can I do as Elfrin to get him out of that ooze? Heal yourself can... for four? Shut up. I'm sorry. Fucking, I'm sorry. Fucking the birds. I'm doing more healing than anybody else in this combat right now, okay? Uh, you would also need a roll for your healing mist. Start of your turn. You already did. I did. Yeah, it was oh. 19. That was oh. 19. But I'm blind. It's okay. Let me go heal my worms real though. quick. Um, well, I can get him out on my turn. Go for him. Like, if you want to delay. Because I, 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 have, an, I have a plan. Bert, it's up to you. <laughs> I'm sorry. Mm. Mm. I can guarantee you get him out of the too. <laughs> guarantee, you say? Yes. Uh, Alright. Alright. Well, I guess nothing to it but to try to... Well, I, can't, I, wanted, I wanted to put damage on the pudding. But I can't. Did they? Uh... I mean, no valid enemy goes before us. So. Alright. Uh, okay, I suppose yeah. I'll delay. Um, if you want to set... Here, I'll add the bird's initiative here so that their initiative stays the same. Because they already did their action. Uh... Mm -hmm. Alright, since this is going to come up, um, do you have anything that boosts your number of rounds you have breath you have, Kotak? Uh, not um, above normal, okay. I believe. Cool. I have listed on your label your rounds of breath. Every time you take an action, that'll be dropped by one. Every time uh, you take damage, that'll be dropped by a certain amount. I took seven damage earlier. While holding your breath? Well, I was inside it. Oh, yeah, because of the, the fire transference. So, yeah, that'd be one round of breath lost. So, I'll put you at 35 instead of 36. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> one could argue that he was in the middle of being pulled in when that happened, so he wasn't out of breath yet. But... Well, I was partially in, and my head was probably in, so. Where my yeah. mouth. Yeah. I mean, so, yeah, you were already doing it. We well, saw your ass get lit on fire. Okay. It's fine regardless. Um. <laughs> Okay, so I, I'm 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 holding. Uh, move the birds up to where my initiative is now, please. Yeah. Since they're now not off my action. Yeah, bu -bu 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 -bu. Also, it'd be a good place just, for the healing mist. I'm, there you are. I'm, thank you. I'm just imagining the dwarf getting sucked uh, face first into a black pudding and looking like he's fighting fire. Mm -hmm. Passing to Jack, of course. All right, Jack, it's your turn. If you wanted to rail, also, Jack, so I can get him out of there. Grick that goes before. Okay, yeah, I'll delay. That Grick's unconscious. I'll and dying. Area and uh, and Grick immediately suffers 15 points of damage. Yeah. Grick is still technically alive, but unconscious. Indeed. Go attack. You start your turn in a Grick, or in a in a black oh, pudding. <laughs> I'm in a Grick? Huh? 
it's, it's, a, it's a black puck. It's a, a dwarf inside of Grick inside a black puck thing. It's like turducken. Yeah. It's a turducken. <laughs> so you immediately suffer ten points of acid damage, including your armor suffering oh. this damage. Do I make a save? Uh, your armor does get a save. Yes. Your armor's fine. But you said for this damage, no. Yeah. All right, but it is your turn. Uh, you're currently, you're blind. You currently, you're holding your breath. So that, just start of your turn, you lose one round of breath. And uh, any actions you take will reduce you by one extra round of breath. Um, additionally, uh, while held in this way, um, I mean, you're grappled, so you already know the penalty to grapple, so yeah. You can do what you wish. Yeah. Do, outside of that. Hmm. I'm blind. Yes. So. So I would have disadvantage on attacks. It means I would have mischance. Yeah. So I'm not disadvantage. And I'm inside it. So. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty much the only way I see you actually missing me. Besides a natural one, is rolling a mischance success. So. So. How. How do you miss? I would consider Ow. the blind being mischance missing because the weapon just gets slurped within a thick amount of jelly where it doesn't swing hard enough to actually hit. That's the only way I would describe it. Otherwise, it's just, you know, you fucking hit. My AC7. Like, that's the only uh, reason I would describe it. Otherwise, we're like, yeah, I don't care if you're blind, you're hidden, but... You see, there's ears, and then there's ears that doesn't really matter. The mischance, you're thinking the ears that doesn't really matter. Yeah. <laughs> I have a question. I can't hear, right? Uh, you're only blind. You're not deafened. I would say you're definitely okay. uh, lessened of what you can hear. So if someone can be heard like 10 feet away or like 100 feet away, you would only hear it from like 50, maybe 25 feet away. So like a quarter of what you normally be, but... Everything's muffled. Like you're doing yeah, direction. pretty much. You're listening to general. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I would probably not hear you saying, you know, or communicating to everyone else that you can get me out. So I'm, you know, I'm in the middle of a black pudding, mm -hmm. but I am raging. Uh, do you have any so poisons like... on your on your person, by the way? No. Okay. Ah. Ale? Are you diseased? <laughs> I know you're not. Carry on. That we know of? <laughs> <laughs> you, all all oh. uh, puddings have this feature, so I, I gave it to it. Oh, or, I forgot. Yeah. Why did I make the ability? I don't I know. I, I didn't give him oh, any poisons good. or disease, but he has it. So if he does find anything. <laughs> I forgot Wait. I made that. God damn it, Alexa. Uh, I'm reading <laughs> it. Wait, so... Oh, you ignore that. He doesn't He doesn't have anything triggered. It's just... In case you had a poison on you, he would have ate it. I'm trying to really understand it. I'm like, oh, that's a lot of text. Yeah. Um, yeah, fuck it. I'm just going to swing at this shit. Why get up with it? He's killed this shit. All and, right. uh, you know, he tried twice. He did try. You know, he... Why do I... Yeah. Uh, Why do I have the feeling that we should not let Jack get consumed by this or... thing? <laughs> I, I actually have a question. Yeah. Do you have it, any poisons on you? Hmm. Technically, by the ruling, I should take half the damage or anything I deal to it. So, does it work that way? Um. Oh, God. Per its wording, it like you it would be the one who takes half damage. Um, I'm going to say, since you're the one who's engulfed, no. But if another person was engulfed, intended. yes. Yeah. yeah, what's the rule as yeah. intended? Yeah. Yeah, rules yeah, intended is I'm that like, they're I'm shooting like, it, which penetrates it enough to hit you. Yeah, because I'm like, I don't, I don't think I should kill myself for this. Nah, you're not gonna kill uh, yourself. Like, you know, if he's cutting off his own fucking uh, limbs. What's but the fuck if, if like, yeah, yeah. say this piggy was in there, then you would hit the piggy. <laughs> oh yeah, fuck the piggy. I don't care. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm, I'm swinging. All oh right. shit. <gasps> Maybe the best place to do DPS is inside of it. <laughs> huh, I have a. I'm not flanking with the piggy, right? No. No, oh, God, no. Yeah, okay. no! What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, Shut there's a line right here. <laughs> Shut up and murder it. <laughs> Am I playing? Get the fuck out. You're gonna hit it regardless. The only thing you're doing is rolling against mischance. Get out of here. Alright. Oh my god. Oh, that will, uh, let's just see if we missed, because mischance, high or low? 
Uh, hi. Hi is good. That is a miss. Okay. I'm still wondering how you miss something you're inside of. Uh, it's difficult. Fucking blind. That is a miss. <sighs> God. <laughs> That is a miss. <laughs> as you swing at the nothingness well, inside of as you swing in that the nothingness inside of this ooze that you can't breathe. <laughs> All right, I have reduced you for two rounds of breath because you attacked with two actions. Anything yeah, else? Fine. Uh, all right, I heal for for fast healing. If I didn't do that, uh, yeah, I didn't do that. I'm healing myself. But yeah, there was just one action. They made three there's attacks. Range. Yeah, there's range for your attack with range. You're right. I need to two weapon fighter. I got swing again. You have another action. Uh, man, I missed three times. Not possibly uh, miss a fourth time, right? Do I do I just inherently know anything about this creature? Um, it's a news. You inherently know you mm. missed three times. Well, I'm thinking lay on hands if uh, restoration is gonna hurt it. Is what I'm. I mean, you can roll me an all but... check about it, dungeoneering. Uh, is it an action or is it? It is an all check against the creature. First damage check is, is free. free. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, and dungeoneering. Yep. Uh, the creature would be healed by positive energy. Okay, good to know. Uh, I'm gonna use lay on hands on myself. All right. The weird yeah, question, can... Sage. Is it as wet as the eggs? He ate earlier. <laughs> I... What? What? It's your what? turn. Did you not hear turn. the name of the chain? Where eggs? What? Get out of here! It's just it's not the Lexo. You're trying too hard. Okay. <laughs> um, well, I'm going to provoke if it has any ants. So I hope it doesn't. Uh, they only have one. Though I went immediately after Lapis, so I actually got it back. So I'm gonna bite you. Uh, nom 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 nom. That's a miss. Yep. Uh, Okay. Well, I'm going to move to here. You immediately I'm heal for the 19, but you're not injured, so you're fine. Yep. Uh, I'm going to up pass my extra spell point. Mm -hmm. I'm going to consume a material. Did not require a wall. Mm -hmm. And then, how far is this? He's 30 feet away. No, not that. I'm double checking how far I can move. Uh, you move 30 feet. No, I'm, I'm checking my spell. Mm. Okay, I can move you 30 feet. I um, should have used notes! <sighs> Sorry. Well, you probably can't hear your song right now. I can't True. hear it. Well, I, um... I'm going to use Syra, because I assume the Raging Dwarf will want to keep fighting. I'd teleport him right here. Where Syra is? Yep, in that square. I'd teleport uh, Totec into that square to immediately get healing. As I oh, yeah. reach up with my magic, with a range, a close range teleport, and bring him back. Um... How are you targeting him? Sage said part of his body was still visible until the oh, okay. next turn. Yeah, sorry, my turn. Oh, okay, okay, sorry. Yep. I misheard that. Didn't hear that. Yep. So I'll bring him back into that square. Boop, boop. Oh, look, you're no longer grappled. And you can suddenly breathe again, and you're no longer blind. And you're healed. For 19 points of damage. Bada oh. bing, bada boom. 
You're also no longer sickened. Just got rid of three conditions right then and there. All right, anything else? All right, Simon's going to shoot fire at you. All right. Pop, pop. That's a slap me for 10. Damage applied. And yeah, it's my turn. All right, Grick number one is going to give the bite upon Nocta. I believe that it opened and Jack was coming out of delay. Coming out of delay? That was also very robotic, but okay. Yeah, your microphone's dying again, Jack. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Yeah, they were coming out of the way after me, Sage. Yep. Gotcha. Yeah. Alright, there you go. A current, toggle hold, toggle hold. Hilfrin. Okay. Uh. I, God, I still want to put damage on that thing, but it just, it's just like. Everything I mean, is annoying right now. You can kinda wanna... now. It won't I know. I know, I'm just, I'm just like. I don't want to take an attack for moving, but also I want to. God, hey. it's annoying. Shut up. I can't. Fuck you. That's rude. I know. Oh, That's why I said it. All I have is a mouth. Sad oh, noodle. It's a sad noodle. I mean, <laughs> if you want to delay until after me, Nocta could move and provoke. Hmm. Or I can just try to murder the fuck out of this Grick. Yeah. Yeah. We're, we're, I'm gonna we're try to murder the fuck out of this Grick. Alright. I'm five foot step up. We have the uh, problem where fighting against it healing in our own aura. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. But that's fine. The, the healing has already passed and we're going before it, so... We need yeah, to deal with these just, at some point. It'll just heal next round, unless we move them. Unless we down it in one turn. Or... Shove hmm. it. Shove it out of that aura. Yeah. Hmm. I'm not trained in this skill, but it's tempting. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you can certainly try. I am a noodle. It would, it would also provoke. It would. Fuck. Fucking bull rush. Fucking plus two bonus against his CMD, which is probably at least three or more. Probably like plus five. Well, you know my strength is five because I mentioned it multiple times. Yeah. So it's at least a plus five. Yeah. Unless I have a penalty to dexterity or something like that. Yeah. Son of a bitch, dude. Like, I feel like I had to do this healing order, but it's fucking annoying. It is a cursed existence. I'm also tempted to throw a uh, damage orb at the fucking ooze. Cause How fuck him. dare my allies use your healing against you? God damn it. I'm mad. I'm sorry, go ahead. I was just gonna... I was going to ask something. Really mm -hmm. quick. Does it might matter? Uh, the other healing orb we had was on our door. It's Crestle has it. Crestle has it. Well, no, we had three left. One on Crestle, our door, and Elfrid. Oh, Ardor's is fucking gone. Okay, I'm making sure. I'll, Bastard. I'll change. I mean, if they were not a roguish character, I would have said they might have left it with you guys, but they were not a party player. Their character was very much, I'm going to do my own thing, so they totally would have left with it. If it were like a really important magic item, I would have given it to you guys regardless. But it was just a consumable, so. I'll delay. Sorry. All right. Jack. All right. Uh, I think... Uh, oh, wait. Did, did you attack? No, you didn't attack. I didn't do anything. Okay. I'm kidding. Uh, yeah, I'm uh, going to. Uh, uh, Nocta is first of all going to provoke attack of opportunity and uh, bull rush. Uh, Greg. All right. And we'll do Greg one. Uh. Here we go. Break one, provoking, do 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 do, they are going to bite you back. Nyam 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 nyam, 25 for 18 and 2. That will hit for 18 and 2. Alright. 
And then let me roll my CMP. I am not pushed. Uh, you left. did waste your uh, your um reaction attack. Yeah. 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 Plus 11, holy fuck. Yeah, I spent a lot to boost their CMD cuz I was like they're noodles. They're going to be hard to push. But worth it. Mm -hmm. Um Yeah, going to go ahead and uh second action uh try to push him again actually. All right. Well, I can't provoke, so I'll just roll my CMD. Same roll. Yeah. Yeah, I doubt I'll beat it. Um, if I can remember exactly where it is. Oh. Uh -huh. Nope. Okay. All right, carrying on. Anything for Jack Proper? Uh, Jack Proper is uh, going to throw... Uh, I gotta get... Nope. Uh... Yeah, I'm going to throw a proper bomb at Black Pudding. All right. The bomb is 40 feet away from you. Yeah, um, uh, that's actually within bomb range, I believe. Nice. Double checking that. Oh, it's on my other sheet. Um... Minimum. These bombs have a range of 10 foot rank per inc per rank bonus in the herbalist or craft alchemy skill. So they so, have 20 feet base range. So you're going to get minus two, but yeah. it's still versus touch. I mean, it's still okay. versus an AC of seven regardless. For some reason, I thought it was 40. You're probably thinking of when you level up, which we'll be doing after this fight. Oh, uh, probably. By level up, I mean reaching German rank. You said it's a uh, negative four to hit? M minus two. My stew. Yeah, it's only one increment. All right. We're, we're, we're doing it. Okay. 22 fire? 22 fire. All right, that yeah. will slap me. Yeah, it does provoke. That noodle already provoked from you. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and what is the splash damage you have? Uh, it is uh, selective. But, uh, oh, cool, it's, cool. Uh, so you can suck the piggy out then. We're good. Yeah. Okay. Never mind. Anything else? Yep. Yeah, uh, Ten foot step over to, actually, just a five foot step over to. Uh... And I'll go full ten. Okay. This little nook. <laughs> All right, Ilfrin. It is my turn to do things now. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna walk my happy ass over here. Yeah. Here we go. I think that it will provoke from the pudding. It would provoke from the pudding. You're correct. Mm. In this you charge. You could charge me. We're actually near the closest is occupied. They're going to provoke the garden. Oh, no, it'd be the closest available square. It's no. never the. It's never no. the. Just. That's and, dumb. And I'm bound to be negative the closest. God. Period. But charging, you have a lot of options. Choices, choices. Anything. I am getting close to my cutoff, so. Yeah, I know. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I'll just take a hit. Let's go. All right. Tentacle. Slappy. Okay. I will... It's the... Uh, and this would grapple me if I let it hit me? It would, like it would potentially have, grapple you. It gives, I get a uh, tent. Pyre's end. There we go. There you so go. I bet 26 AC against that. Yep, you're good. All right. I'll move here, and I will cast defensively. Can okay, I succeed? It is first level. Surprise. Um... I'm going to go ahead and cast myself some Seed Burst here. Yeah. Uh, that... I'm going to spend half as much as I see it to, to do it again. Yep, that's a successful cast. And you have an 8 touched against me for 22 piercing? Uh, yes. 22 piercing damage. Okay. And we'll take the damage on this. I mean, if you don't care, we'll take the uh, the attack and damage on second one. Because it, uh, it is a duo one. Sorry, the... Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do the other one. Yeah, I'll do both. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, so, duplicate... Uh, yep. For duplicates effects, real quick, uh, do you have to choose the targets for when you cast the spell, or do you can choose them as I, you go? It has to be a valid target, and I believe it is the same target. Actually, no. Hold on a second. Duplicate. Oh, it's 5-foot range me... anyway, so... Uh, yeah. 
First one will do 12 piercing damage to me after a DR. And I do need to know if you can change your target. I create multiple objects or projectiles when casting a spell. So it does not say I have to choose, well, uh, but yeah. I will provide you this. As soon as it, you shoot the speed, uh, seeds burst slamming into it, the creature will begin to wiggle and jiggle as it splits. Oh my fucking god. That's... Oh uh, my nice. fucking god. Well, let me go and change its HP. I take half of the HP remaining at the end of this, so... My oh! Two gives me... Alright, so this one's HP... Does that, but does that mean they have a new maximum hit points as well? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's nice. So so this one won't get... needs to be healed. Right. What the fuck? <laughs> Wait a minute. That's not good. I'm All ignoring right. this one for now. <laughs> And then, yeah. for purposes of size, I'm gonna make them large just for funsies. Mm. So, it, yeah. Alright, and then we go, right. go hit the damage macro on them real quick just so their HP bar resets. Yep. There we are. Alright, there you go. And the other one is on which one? Uh, the top one. Top one, okay. And that would it be just makes sense. I mean, 36 yeah. damage, yeah. 36 reduced to 26. It's pretty good. And it'll split again. <laughs> I I'm gonna take this as a win. <laughs> yeah. I'm take this as a no. Am I winning, son? <laughs> Am I winning, dead? Here. Damage adjusted. And damage adjusted. Changing size to medium. There we go. I feel safer now. <laughs> Don't know if that's a mistake. We need to be parried now. Yeah. There, yeah, yeah, there you go, Kotak. You're fucking welcome. <laughs> oh, there's the rage of me. All right, very good. Anything else? That is it. All right. A Grick. Technically, they won't reduce in size that drastically, but uh, it's it's funnier this way, so. Yeah, fuck it. All right, Grick number it. one is going to flank slam the Nocta. <laughs> Just Ilford punches it and then fucking, like... <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah. Then we have a 22 for Nocta for flanking. For uh, 14 bludgeoning and 7 precision. Which will then trigger Rend. Assuming you don't parry that. Oh, uh, I don't think... Oh, I, sh I really should try to parry it. You should. Yeah. If only I wasn't wounded. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. And then two more tentacles. All right. The last one will slap you for another 14 and 12. All right. So, so you're looking at a total of... uh. 28 bludgeoning and 19 precision oh, for two attacks. Oh. All right, and that, that's one's turn. We go to Kressel. Kressel's going to have her piggies attack first. We're going to have this piggy attack the black pudding. Bludgeoning. And it'll be uh, a double hit, but a little, little piggy. Hell yeah. Person will deal 12 damage. Which will then cause it to split. I don't think that was enough to have it be a... Uh... Let's see here. Divide by two gives me that much. Yeah, I'm not sh I don't think that was enough to... It's really close. Yeah, okay. Let's make I'm going to make it medium. Then Peggy's other attack will crit and confirm, and will do 34 points of damage, which will just outright kill this one. It, it can't crit them. You're right. <laughs> Sage. Darn. <laughs> I, I keep forgetting. They're amorphous. That's number, that's number seven. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm not keeping track of light. All right. And then these two will go to small size, and their uh, HP will be adjusted to be that. That both escalated and de-escalated very quickly. Yep. The issue is, whenever I get my turn, I now have four attacks. I mean, yeah, it it, it is what it is. All right, and then this piggy is going to just charge forth and slam that Grick. 
By charging me, it's gonna stab him. Yeah. Critical confirm! For realsies this time! For oh, realsies? 26 damage. Reduced by DR of 18, so that is 8 damage. Alright. And then we're gonna just picky attack again, because we can picky attack again. That'll miss. Black puddings! Oh boy. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, it's gonna go top down. And then this guy at the very end. Top buddy is gonna attack Ilfrin. Have a tentacle. That will miss. Have a tentacle. That will also miss. Have an Apex Hunter, my last one for the day, because they're one creature still, technically. That will miss. Alright. Next in the line, this one will attack the piggy. Oh no! The piggy poofs into Stardust. <gasps> it will then no. attack Ilfren. No! <laughs> <laughs> miss! Alright. Next one. This will attack Kotak. This fucking shield is paying off, dude. Dividends. Uh, this is a plus one to hit you. 20 to hit. Uh, free reaction plus 3C. Alright. <laughs> I will tentacle again. Shield bonus. Plus one to hit. It's a miss. This one here is going to tentacle you, Kotak. Plus one to hit. 21. Oh, I'm going to attempt to parry that. Parry! Alright, you're good. And we then go to this putty. Gonna slurch its way forward and we'll enter into the healing aura. It doesn't need any healing. And we'll slap into Kotak. Plus one, 21 to hit. I'm gonna attempt to use my second defensive action to parry again. Aha! Fail, oh. 18 no. and 9. And also a free grapple attempt. With advantage, because grab. And they still got the plus nine. Jesus. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's a CMD. Oh, wait. Uh, my, my grapple would be too lower. Okay. Yeah. Actually, does it get adjusted by... Uh... Ah! No. <laughs> that doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. It's a 32. Pretty good, pretty good. Not a fucking yep. gen. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, that was my first attack against you. Here's my second attack. I can hit. Uh, 20 AC? Nah. Alright. Um. All my oozes will use their quick actions to suction. As you see them kind of just slurp it upon the dirt. What the fuck? For funsies, I'll click the macro. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it does nothing. They have no yeah. other use for their quick action. Oh, that's very... Uh, that's All right, top of the round. I'm going to call it here because I do have to get ready and yep. head out. Oh, but, uh, hope you guys had fun. Uh, you guys wow. will be getting at least 30 experience. Maybe more. Uh, definitely more, actually. So do think what you're going to be doing with your German rank as you will be getting German rank after this fight. Well, we reached the threshold to be around the bad German rank. Fair. You you... Have XP. Well, the, the, the Greeks are giving you guys 30 experience alone. Just because each is worth five and there's six of them. Oh god, there's black pudding. Oh. And then there's black pudding experience, so. And the oh. black pudding is a boss, so it gives more experience. Mm -hmm. Any which ways. God, yeah. I'm gonna pop on off. Hope you guys had fun. Oh. <laughs>